So, test one, two, three. Are we online? I hope we are. Are we? Hmm, what does YouTube say? YouTube says we are online. Ah, oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> so. And that is very silent. That's interesting. One second. Why is it so silent? Was that me? We have some interesting music, some very silent music this time. Um, <laughs> very romantic, actually. So, and yeah, today we are going to continue on our merry way ah, in the western continent, even though we are on the eastern continent uh, right now. So, because, because we will go on and check Particio's story and how he is planning to relieve us of 80 billion in, uh, yeah, in problems that we basically have. And uh, then we are going to check how Casty is doing in Sai, which, uh, as far as we know, like in Sai, there is supposedly like a big event. Uh, for dancers and musicians, which I find, let's say, interesting, because it's like it's in a region where there's war, and you know, war is usually not so good for stuff like that. But hey, um, apparently it is cool. <laughs> I have no clue actually. So uh, yeah, I guess let's travel. But ah. Before we do that, before we do that, before I completely forget it, um, we are going to go here to Storm Hill and we're getting, you know, uh, some goodies. So our uh, adventurers, our three guys here, are a little bit better prepared. So first, uh, we are going... Let's check. So nobody needs that, but two body could do a uh, two people could do with a spear. So especially Particio, but also Casty. Um. So let's yeah, let's get two of those. Yep, Casty and Particio. So we have that. So then the hatchet. Um. For Casty, it doesn't make sense. Like, her hatchet has so much elemental attack on her as well. For Agnia, Agnia is a different thing. Like, she has... Uh, her hatchet is okay, but... Yeah, Agnia gets another one as well. Okay, then the bow. Casty could use a bow. So, do we have enough money for that to spare? Nah... We now now we have to look for shield. Shield is now more important. Um, oh god, oh god! All, all of them need one. Here you go, guys. And now I am out of money, actually. <laughs> oh dear god. Uh, let's see. What can I sell? That a rare stone. Um, jewel. I, I keep the purse of hope because it's cute. <laughs> so uh, then we have those swords. The Aegis sword I keep. Uh, I thought that that one is pretty good. So then the matching trident. I think this one is important for some sort of quest. So I keep it. Then this scorched bone spear. No, uh, we don't need that. Paladin's lance. We also don't need. Nightmare glaive. Uh, put target to sleep, but it's not very strong and it puts down the accuracy really, really bad. So, X of Avarice. That was the one that Casty had. Uh, yeah, we don't need that anymore. So, Guardian, Great X. It really, wh why do they put down the accuracy so much? I mean, critical is nice and all, but yeah, no. Uh, no, I'm fine without that. Marksman bow is... Oh, Casty has that one right now. Eh, that's not so cool. 
So, what about those ones? They are shit. Oop, this one too. So, shield. Oh, weak shield. Nobody needs that. Spike shield. Nobody needs that. Feather shield. Nobody needs that. So, what do we have with the ha Oh, my goodness. Those are some bad helmets. <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Guards helm. Oh, God. I, I, I really collected those. Fur cap. Cassius. Oh, God. I'm making a lot of money only with those, and they are like all over the place. Horned helmet. Uh, no. 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 Meow. Lighthouse Keeper's bandana. Oh, it puts some critical out. Okay. Um. Let's see. We could use this at least. No, I don't want to sell it. I want actually to equip. Uh, to equip it. Uh, who needs critical of those guys? Um, Particio? No, he's... They're all very support-focused. Honestly. Um, hmm. Ah, that's a good... It's really a good question. I go with Casty, honestly. I go with Casty. So, okay. Now let's check uh, what else can we get. We can get a great helmet. So their Casty would lose critical, but she has mm, rather good stuff. Honestly, they all, that's, that's not so much of a raise. Shield, yeah, they have the shield. The armor piece. Um, no. Physical defense would rise. They will all lose some of stuff and no. Okay, so I think my little helpers here, those characters are now fine. Okay. Um, good. Then let's go over here. Volgrove. That's right. I had a business here. Yeah, and that would be the last one. So... You see how he's smiling? I was like, yeah, you better be smiling. Hopefully you find a way to pay off 80 billion leaves. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, Particia has signed a contract with the industry magnet rock. Yeah, this idiot. Uh, if Particia can come, come up with 80 billion leaves, rock will sell the rights to the steam engine to him. Particia travels to Valgrove to speak with the wealthy noble Alrond, a potential financier. I mean, it's all, that's all nice and dandy, uh, to be honest, but yeah, not sure about that, if that is going to work, but hey, we will see. <laughs> we will see. Huh, so this is Wellgrove. This is where I'm supposed to find that Alron fella, richest noble in the West. Right, time to put on my best smile and charge on in. You just wait, Alrond. I'm coming to find you. Yeah, hopefully nobody hears that. That sounds like a threat. Huh. Yeah, what? I heard this was the most hopping commerce hub in all the continent, but... Kinda quiet here, ain't it? I barely see a soul. Yeah, that's well, interesting. Might as well check out the town while I try to find this Alrond. Wait, that is the biggest commerce hub? Not one of the... Of the harbor cities? Now that is odd. I have to say. Hmm. I find this odd. So, can we use some sticky flower? It reduces speed and evasion. Here's a single ally of terror. Oh, we had that. Uh, let's get some of those. Yeah. Yeah, let's get some of those. Okay, so, and before we continue, just give me one second while I check something. Yeah, no. Um, seems to be all right. Seems to be... Everything is all right. Okay, fantastic. Okay. Da -da -da. Um, is it... Go. 
So, okay. Just checked on the connection. Um, because I changed a little bit up again on the OBS. It's, yeah, uh, very interesting. This whole what you can do in OBS. I still am learning probably very slowly, but hey. <laughs> so, hello. Scrutinize. Do we have stuff? Merchant who is, above all else, cheerful. Even when she can sell a thing, she always has a smile for everyone she meets. This sunny disposition does not come naturally, however, it is all because of the support she receives from a certain young artisan. Oh, And she has energizing poem grenade. Greatly restores boost point to a single ally. Hmm, okay. Interesting, interesting. Do -do -do. What's with those guys? Hey, what do you have? Heavy coin pouch. Batches are for price. Oh, that is good. Restores HP to everybody. We need that. So, and what do you have? A girl stepfather. A wealthy older man who lives in Mill Grove. Oh, yeah. Ah, that was uh, with, with the child that we took care of. <laughs> good for us. So, strengthening serum. Mod venturing your earth. We are doing that. We are absolutely doing that. And who are you guys? Excuse me. Can I interest you in a statue made of the purest silver? What? It's a genuine Ores Rush article, and I've got the appraisal papers to prove it. Uh, is silver that abundant that they can make statues made out of solid silver? Wow, it's beautiful. How much? Each of these is currently going at the low, low price of 500,000 leaves. Five Low price of 500,000. There we are with those ridiculous amounts again. <laughs> I'd pass if I were you. Genuine silver? Ah, bunch of hogwash. <laughs> How dare you? That's a baseless claim. Uh, I wouldn't say so. Real silver's delicate. Leave it out in the sun and it blackens. It ain't sparkling or darkening, so it's probably just a bunch of scrap iron. Just who are you? Hmm. Particio, at your service. A simple traveling merchant who hails from Ores Rush. This is what real Ores Rush silver looks like. Don't forget it. Ding. <laughs> Damn. Yo. Bye. <laughs> I owe you one. It seems you have a wealth of knowledge at your disposal. Of course I do. Erudition is the heart and soul of commerce. What the heck is erudition now? Spoken like a true merchant. Please, let me treat you to a drink as a token of my thanks. How about a shot of spirits? Our town is renowned for its drink. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that sounds mighty nice. Sure. Okay. Is that the scene from... By the by, I don't know. Were you uh, searching for something back there? Uh, no, nothing in particular. Just a spot of treasure hunting. I stop by the stalls now and then, hoping to find one. Not that I have an eye for it. Ah, that's a worthy pastime. No one's born with an eye for value. You gotta train it. I've lived in this town for a long time, you know. Oh, do we do we find out now why the town is not bustling and stuff? Once upon a time, it was filled with happy people and fine goods. It was a lively place. Huh, okay. Times, they're always changing, huh? Erudition is well read with a bit of bright thinking. Okay. I learned a new word today. <laughs> I wish the only spirits that went down the hatch in our town were the drinks. Particio, why did you come here? I'm looking for someone. Goes by the name of Alrond. The Alrond? <laughs> He's one of the wealthiest people in all the West. I hear he wipes his backside with silk 
handkerchiefs. Silk kerchiefs? <laughs> I couldn't afford to do that if I spent all my days mining silver. Why is silver so worthless in this world? Think he'd be willing to sell those kerchiefs? I'd even buy them used. <laughs> yeah, you. <laughs> you. You didn't know that word. Nope, I Look, didn't. What I'm trying to say there are a lot of words I don't he know. He lives in a different world from the rest of us. His time's too valuable to meet with just anybody. Unless you prove your worth, you're out of luck. Well, Patricio has 80 billion in debt. Is that worth enough? <laughs> yeah, makes sense. Man cleans his rump with silk. Still, I wish I knew how to get in contact with him. I may know a way. But Alrond knows business like a refined palate knows foie gras. He mm. might agree to meet with you, if you had some distinguished achievement to point to. Hmm. Hmm. That's so. Oh, we have some. We have killed so many monsters. Okay, that is that a distinguished uh, achievement? Uh, I can yeah ship. How about that? I have a ship. And that's about the size of it. Unbelievable! A vessel from the Tropu Hopu shipyards, you say? The last head shipwright was a legend, renowned the world over for his craft. Yeah, we know. Songs were sung about the beauty of his ships, and rumor is they sped across the waves like a swallow in flight. The richest merchants in the world begged him to build them a vessel. Yeah, and now we have Yet it. He refused Isn't it cool? to work for anyone except those he deemed worthy. I'm in I... awe that you managed to convince that shipyard to furnish you with a craft. So, is that enough now, is the question? You really are a true merchant. Yeah, okay, it, thank you, thank you, all I'm thank sure you, but can we... Alrond will feel the same. Good, that's the point that I wanted to thank get you, to. <laughs> I'll be sure to get in touch with him for you. Come to his estate later, and all will be made ready. You'll find it atop the hill in the northern part of town. Yeah, it's a big, it's a big palace, okay, it's a big palace. How is this young du random dude, by the way, just saying, yeah, I get in touch with him for you. Make sure he he uh, sees you. I was like, is is you Elrond? Uh, is that you? For some reason or what? Well then, I just hope my discerning customer bites. Time to head to Elrond's estate to see if my hard work paid off. Because that is, you know, so that is really, hmm, sus, <laughs> honestly. So what's the travel banter? The villagers gave me a whole big pa uh, basket of peaches. Peaches. Come to think of it, Pala said something odd about peaches once. I believe it was the biggest peaches win the pie. Hey there, Agnia, what are you up to? Well, we look at peaches of yours, nice and round and juicy. Did you see? Hold still a sec, let me see those fine things. But what are you saying? Uh, sorry if I came too strong. I just can't resist giving such a nice looking peaches an appraisal. I, made a look, look, uh, I may not look it, but I've squeezed a lot of peaches before. Close off, stand on. So squeezed? <laughs> let me carry those beauties one stroke, I can grade them from A to G. <laughs> what is going on? Car is that still safe for work what is going on here <laughs> oh don't worry it'll be gentle i won't nibble them unless you let me uh, wait 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 a second you're talking about the peaches in the basket right <laughs> oh, God. i have as many as you like take them and go oh really thank you kindly sure oh sorry i adopted you partitio <laughs> i have no clue i think partitio was playing a little bit with her and more travel banter who is it now oh hmm a distinguished achievement the search for capital is a difficult and treacherous venture. Yeah, uh, especially if it's 80 billions. Poverty nearly proved my demise once upon a time. Huh? You were poor once too, partner? When I was a student? Yes. With only a few leaves left to my name, I was forced to choose between bread or books. 
despite knowing what it would lead to great that it would lead to great suffering, I choose the latter. Hunger I can do, but my thirst for knowledge can never be sated. In the end, I fainted from malnutrition and had to spend a tidy sum on treatment from an apothecary. Ha! <laughs> that sounds just like you, partner. I was pretty poor myself once, too, you know? I didn't even have the least to worry about how it spends them. Day after day, I chewed weeds and sipped brackish water. Still, for all the pain I suffered, that experience taught me to appreciate what I had. More than that, it made me want to share and share alike, especially precious things. Oh yeah, precious, shiny. An interesting outlook and valuable insight. I have no desire for material wealth. Knowledge is all I seek. Oh, uh, I seek, I seek material wealth. I need shiny. <laughs> Erudition is an asset too, partner. One that's priceless. <coughs> Even in another world, students are poor. Yeah, apparently. <laughs> So, but also, um, I wonder, let's see, what? Peddler, a traveling merchant specializing in textiles. He came to Wellgrove after hearing there was a business hub of the Western continent. As it happens, he's also a fashion designer who makes original garments from the textiles uh, he gets. Hmm. Okay. And hidden item found. So I remember we have to find this textile, uh, some sort of textile thingy, and also a florist named Roland, and probably like really, really good. Hmm. Weird. I thought he might be in Walgrove, you know, because it's in the name. So what's the falcon code? It is awful. Pretty much. Uh, yeah, no. Nobody takes that. Nope. I can sell that later. So, supposedly there should be some Alrond guy. Person. So, and here is dance guy, uh, dance person. How do I get more? One look can tell you all I need to know. Da -da -da. You have... Oh, a dancer's divine skill. Fantastic. I have it. I have a second one. Hey! <laughs> okay, I can have three dancers now in my group. That's cool. Okay. And... Scrutinize. Evasive stance. What did she... Huh? Wind soul stone. Silver harpy... Hairpiece. Speed. Nah. That's not worth it. And you? Thunder soul stone. Um, nah. Nah. Hmm. So now is the question. Is there some person here that knows a lot about flowers? What? So an apothecary who has predicted in town... Uh, yeah, who has practiced in town for many years. Her only daughter hopes to take over her business at some point, but when she looks back on her own life, in which she was forced to put her patience over her own family, she finds it hard to support her daughter's plans, flattering as it may be. Hmm. What does she has? Enhances effects, raises elemental defense. Um, yeah, no, I have those. I'm fine. Hmm. Uh, I don't know if I even will find a Roland. That will be interesting. So, okay, then here is the estate I fell in love with. I want that. God damn it, eh? <laughs> what a palace. What a palace. Yo. Whew, rich is noble in the West, huh? Yeah. It looks basically like uh, any orphanage that we visited. Or the Thieves Guild. Or the sewers. Hmm. Why is yes, everybody looking rich? <laughs> Come to think hmm. of it, I wonder how that young fella knows Elrond. Ah, oh, that is a good question. Huh? Is he his servant? Master Particio, I take it. Word has reached me you would be coming. The master's study is this way. If you'd follow me. Hmm. Uh, uh, thank you. 
Well then, let's find out if something interesting is happening. Misha, yeah. This way, please. Misha is isn't that a Russian uh, female name? I think so, but you know better. <laughs> I think. Huh? You're that fella from earlier. Funny meeting you here. Get lost or something? Lost? <laughs> you really are an intriguing man, Particio. Yeah, that intriguing was clear. enough to win an audience with the master of this house. Welcome to <laughs> my man, Particio. <laughs> I am none other than Alrond himself. Yo, look. All suddenly he's looking like a king. What the heck? <laughs> Uh, Misha, thank you kindly. Yeah, I, it sounds it sounds female to me, but uh, <laughs> suddenly he has this royal garment. Holy shit! Wait, hold on. <laughs> oh, oh god! What? It's a male name. We also call bears like that sometimes. Oh, okay. Y you're Alron. What? Why? Yeah. Ah, uh, and a show now. Don't think ill of me, Particio. I had my reasons to disguise myself as the Everyman. As one of the wealthiest people on the continent, I find that most put on a false mask when speaking to me. Yeah, I wonder it's much why. It's to judge someone's true character by how they treat you when they think you're nothing special. Yeah, I wonder why they put on a mask. Could it be that you are wearing gold? With embroidered with gold and golden ornaments? I want that. Oh, I see. It's it looks I so shit. I need that. <laughs> that his penchant for disguise is in poor taste. Uh, but he never listens to me. Oh dear. Am I going to save this Forgive guy? Me my indulgences, Misha. Is something happening and I'm going to save him you or something? I have no idea. A cut above the common merchant, Particio. That is why I have invited you here. Now, you said you had business with me. Looking for money, I assume. Yeah, uh, how could you tell? Particio, are you like all the others? Come, speak your piece. Uh, you've got me pegged, so... I'll get straight to the point. I want to buy the rights to the steam engine, and I need capital to do it. Steam engine, you say? Pursuing the latest trends, are we? I have my eye on it as well. The coming era will be an age of steam, if I read the future right. Yeah, you will. Yep, it's got a lot of power and a lot of potential to make the world a better place. <laughs> Problem is, the fellow who owns the rights to it ain't interested in using it for the people's benefit. I'm a merchant, that's true, but I believe there's something out there more valuable than wealth. People's happiness. I want to be in the business of trading bliss. Oh dear, that sounds uh, awfully like drugs. <laughs> so... I figured I'd buy up the rights to the steam engine, so I could share the wealth, so to speak. An interesting proposal indeed. I assume your purchase has a price tag? Yeah, tell him. Tell him how much you are in debt. 80 billion leaves. Uh, 80 billion? Yeah. That is certainly not cheap. And yet your proposal bears consideration. B but sir and now you tell me he has not that much <laughs> uh, the steam engine will make jobs lots of jobs for all sorts of folk especially for those who don't have the means to earn a living wage if i have my way the steam engine will help all those troubled folks make enough to feed their families yeah, and if Rock has their, his way, the steam engine will put all in slavery. So, that yeah. That way, <laughs> the world will be a better, happier, more prosperous place. So, Alrond, what do you say? Want to invest in my dream for the future? 
And now comes Ende. Marticio, you truly are a charismatic individual. That is sounds like the start to a no. However, my purse strings do not come undone for a smile and a song. Before I invest, I need a closer appraisal of your caliber. Okay, that uh, means what? Do you want me to take my shirt off or something? <laughs> Why is Partitio so adult right now? <laughs> uh, no, please stay dressed. And then but AI kicks in. Oh, something. yeah. Yeah. If you remove something, is it my gold uh, gold purse? You Let don't get my money. The veneer off Wellgrove. The veneer off what? Once this town was filled with energy and laughter. Yeah, and why don't you do something about it? You are probably the leader the or something. Shifted, and an economic depression settled upon this once prosperous town. Okay. It was my father who put the final nail in the coffin that was Wellgrove's economy. How do you do that? That's an interesting question. Why? He threw Why? money at the problem, in the hopes of turning this town's fortunes around. <laughs> I mean, that's what most billionaires do. And funnily enough, it works. What do you think all the townsfolk did when he gave them hefty sums of leaves for free? Uh, they used it like every normal person would? Some stopped bothering to work. Others took the money and moved far away. Yeah, that's stupid. All the while, our town declined. In the end, money had no power for positive change here. <sighs> so I want you to revitalize this dying town, Particio. Okay, that is easier said than done. If you can do that, I'll invest in your brighter tomorrow. Okay, um... However, you will not see a single leaf from me until you complete this task. Okay, I have to save your town, if it's nothing else. Hmm, I accept your challenge. I mean, I stopped sort of a war already. And I'm planning to start a new one, I guess, saving a town. Oh yeah, I almost destroyed a town. And another one. Yeah, that, that, I think that's my caliber of work. I'll fix up your town for you, <laughs> and I'll give it all I got. Good. I expect great things from you. Righto. Time to head down to the market and see what I can do. Well... Hey, yay, 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 yay. So, let's hear it. What is Cassie saying? Alrond is an odd one, isn't he? He's fabulously wealthy nobleman, and yet he dresses like a pauper. Yeah, but I think I'd do the same thing if I was wearing his shoes. You would? Yep. Wouldn't mind throwing off all those unnecessary things like wealth and privilege. Sometimes what you need most is a heart-to-heart -heart with someone on equal terms. <laughs> well said. We're of like mind. Hmm? What do you reckon? The truth is, I'm the daughter of a powerful noble family myself. My full name is Castier de Francois. I used to live in a palace, alive with a fresh scent of roses all year long. That memory came back to me not too long ago. You're pulling my leg, right? Oh, and I thought I had you for a second there, too. <laughs> oh, dear. Feeling fine on town scale already, huh? Yeah, I mean, if we look at the map, let's check. Let's check. Just just for the funsies, okay? Um, I saved Aura... Uh, I, well, I, yeah, I saved Aura's Rush. I almost destroyed Crackridge. Um, I definitely... Positively endangered Stormhill. Um, I took over basically the illegal, whatever the fuck uh, arena it was in Mondwise. Uh, what else? What else? Uh, yeah, I annoyed the leader of Clockbank basically. Um, what else did I do? What else did I do? Nothing here. Uh, what can I remember? Oh yeah, I stopped a war in Sai. And I'm planning another one. 
Um, what did I do in Conning Creek and in in Kenelbrine? Oh yeah, and I saved Kenelbrine from you know getting sick and dying and all this un un uh, unfriendly shit. So uh, yeah, I think that's my level. <laughs> I think that is my level already. Oh. So, but yeah, as far as we know, there is no Roland here. Hmm. What do you have? Inspiriting Plum Basket and an Invigorating Nut. I am sorry, but I need your stuff. I <clears throat> I need that stuff. Thinking time. Oh, thinking time. My thinking is just throw elements at this problem. No. Indulge me for a moment. And done. I've gained valuable insight. Fantastic! Okay, we have a new basket and we have inventory invigorating nut. Raises maximum SP that is something, oh god, that is something that Hikari needs. Yeah, Hikari will get that thing. Also, what's with the jobs? Oh yeah, I have new dancer possibilities. <coughs> so, then let's check. Hmm. Hmm. Orthrone. Yeah, Orthrone, that's, that's true. And he is... Low prices, friends. No prices. Yawns. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, he is not interested there. really. You look like you need a nap, fella. Let me see your merchandise. Oh, these are fine quality wares. Let me try hawking them. I'll sell them for twice the price, guaranteed. Um, okay. Howdy there, miss. Have I got a deal for you? Oh, he he's he's putting a snake charmer. <laughs> he's putting in See a snake charmer carpet? performance. It's not just any old rug. <clears throat> your eyes on this pattern. Seem familiar? It's Timberane's own symbol. This is a high quality, first class national product. What's all the hubbub? Not only that, it's going for a one-time only bargain price. Miss this chance to buy and you'll regret it. Okay, how to be a good merchant. Uh, lie. <laughs> That's what I learned. <laughs> Just lie. I'll take one. Me too. <laughs> Thank y'all for the patronage. Partition costs crowd control. Yeah, silver tongue. <laughs> That's what it is. I sold those mats for twice your initial price. Y you're something else. Yeah, he's a really good liar and manipulator. <laughs> the commerce, the Falcon, the traitor himself. <laughs> no. Simple fact is, no one will want to buy from a merchant who looks gloomier in a rainy day. Have confidence in the quality of your own goods, and the customers will gather like flies to honey. Hmm. Wow, I feel like a whole new merchant. Yo, that was easy. <laughs> huh, I've got a handle on this pickle now. These merchants lack the fiery passion needed to tug at customers' hearts uh, and their purse strings. Yeah, especially their purse strings, huh? But get enough sparks together, and you've got yourself a good old bonfire. Hmm. To lay down some tender. How about I get all the shops in one place? If I can spruce up some abandoned storefront to host them, why? Yeah, that's the ticket. This will work for sure. Wait, 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 wait. You want to, uh... Of course, I need the right marketplace to spruce. If he now comes up with the idea to buy a house so we have a huge marketplace on my money, then I get angry. Huh? Hang on. 
Because again, no, no, we are not buying this house. No, Patricio, no, no, sit. Patricio wants to buy a house from my money. Excuse me. Huh, looks like this place is abandoned. If Patricio now says, hey, we need one million leaves and I'm in this story to get one million leaves until I have one million leaves, then ah, I will be mad. That makes it ideal for my scheme. Righty then, time to put my refurbishing boots on. When I'm done with the place, customers will swarm in here for sure. I've got all my plans settled. All that's left is to recruit the merchants. Okay. Hit three, uh, hire, hire them, oh, okay. By the way, here's really nothing. Is there anything, why is that place empty? There's nothing. Huh. Well, okay, then let's hire merchants. Whoops. Hmm. Jake. <clears throat> well then. Hey, I recognize you. To tell the truth, I, I've taken quite a shine to your mer mercantile ways. Sure, you got a lot to teach. I'd like to learn it all. Yeah. It'd be more pleasure to show my know how. Okay. Okay. I hope for Patricio I don't have to pet to spend money on that or I will get mad at him. I know I repeat myself, but I have to repeat myself. Patricio is costing me money. So, by the way, who are you? Townsperson. Mm -hmm. Oh, I, I already mocked him. Okay. Uh, everything is fine. <laughs> Looks like common house of culture out here, except much more fine condition. Okay. I guess that makes sense. Oh, hey, are you the guys that uh, that wanted to reform merchant? Yeah. Was that this guy that we scared away? I've heard about your travelers. They say you're none too shabby as a merchant. Think you could spare a secret or two? I don't have any secrets, but I'd be happy to show you how I do business. That's an offer I can't refuse, thank you. Okay. That was rather easy, that just need, needed how money. About this <laughs> part, Patricio? Huh. Entrance is too narrow. Let's take down this here wall. A wall? Uh... That'll fix it so customers can step on in all lively like. Are you sure you should just you tear down it. random walls? Interesting. So you plan to have all the traders gather into one centralized marketplace? Yeah. A fascinating idea. In fact, it may birth a new commercial concept entirely. You mean a bazaar? Uh, I'm sorry, that uh, that concept is old. <laughs> <laughs> I've already come up with a name. Alron's Department Store. Yeah, some walls ah, ain't random. Yeah, true. Because each shop is in its own department within the greater whole. You have a fine sense for naming. Don't I just, Mr. Alron, sir? Enough of that. Alrond will do just fine. Particio! I've heard the news! I've heard all the news! Oh no, not that kid again. I have a fucking stalker! Ah, what hold you crawl out of, Scrivener? The scoop hole! Wherever there's a story, there's a Scrivener! Particio has... okay. Particio... Uh, I forgot, what, what, what did I just say? Yes, a stalker. That is it. Anew in dilapidated commercial district. He has a stalker. I am um, creeped out. Does it again. The flag of a new business unfurls. Let me handle the promotion for this amazing enterprise, Particio. 
Oh, you'd do that for me? I mean, you cannot stop her as well. You betcha. I have a brother, you know. He's got this line he loves bringing out. I mean, wait, she followed us from the eastern continent. How did she do that? The world's filled with people groaning under the weight of a thousand problems. It's fresh ideas like yours that bring a ray of joy into troubled lives. In short, I want to help. That's all fine After and nice, all, but okay. I became a scrivener to spread good news. Not bad. <laughs> In that regard, I'm a lot like you, Particio. Ori, you're good folk, you know that? Here, this one's on the house. A pre-opening present for a fine rider. It's free press. It free even look after you're on another continent. It's, you know, I find that concerning. That's a kid that followed me around from one continent to the other. That costs money. That's dangerous. Okay. Really? Thanks. I'll be sure to bring my fanciest words to bear. <laughs> Life seems to be returning to my town. Yeah, lucky that I came around and took care of it. What's your job? Oh, look. Thank you kindly, everyone. This place is looking fine and fresh because of all y'all. Huh, oh, that actually looks pretty nice. There's only one issue left. Yeah, our shelves are looking melancholy and bare. Yeah, you need to fill them. So, how are we supposed to stock all the various goods to make this place a success? But how? Just stock them in. <laughs> no worries on that frontier. I'll go gather up the goods myself. What? Y'all see to the finishing touches while I'm out and about. You got it! Ah, this will be a fine store for sure. <laughs> Not only ship travel, but supposedly following after you in all the forests and stuff. Yeah. Like, this girl is scary. Hmm. Strange. I got the feeling I was being watched just now. Yeah, probably by so uh, ah, Rogue's uh, idiot in white. Now, on the business. Or your other stalker. Or maybe, like, does Patricia have... Uh, is, is that his storyline? He has stalkers? Oh, look. A guy in a hood. Of course. What does a department store like ours need? Well, everything... Sure I can gather something good from the towns I've visited up till now. Right. First stop is... There. Huh? Uh, what? Hello again, Tropu Hopu. Now, what should I stock up on here? Oh, because of uh, he got the ship here? Is it because of that? Tropu Hopu coffee is the finest in the land. You said it. I hear even the king sips a cup every morning. Oh, coffee, you don't say. The rich aroma of brewing coffee should pull in customers by the score. Righty then, coffee beans it is for the shop's first showpiece wear. Uh, what the, hmm. Okay, I gotta do this as well. Hey, by the way, can I do something with him? No, nothing at all hmm by the way what do you have oh he has a thunder soul stone huh you know what i take it Much hmm i'm still wondering what i have to do with this guy like he needs to go to sleep but everybody that i have can only put him to sleep on night and he needs to go to sleep at daytime at least I think so. Okay, let's get some coffee. Hello. Coffee beans. Thanks for the business, friend. I appreciate it. 
Next stop, Clock Bank. It'll be nice to see Floyd's smiling face again. Clock Bank? Floyd? Oh, Floyd. That, that, that guy. <laughs> Look who it is, Portesio. Hey, how's it going? Fantastic, thanks to you. Glad to hear it. Now, mind if I ask a question? Oh, not at all. For you, I'd be happy to field a hundred. I'm trying to Tried find to scrutinize the master fisherman. No, Got I did not. That may, might be a thing. But I don't think it's about some fishermaster. It's. I think it's just that dude needs to go to sleep. But at daytime, not at nighttime. But everybody that I have that could put him to sleep only can do that at nighttime. I, I don't know. Hmm. Why not pocket watches? I didn't know there were clocks so small they fit in your pocket. There are. Perhaps you could tell by the clock tower, but our town has a close relationship with things that tick in any form. Well, that settles it then, Floyd. Our second showpiece wear will be clock bank pocket watches. Yeah, and he's basically saying that to me. I, I guess Floyd is now confused as heck. <laughs> so, purchase pocket watches. Okay. Um, can I not do that to Floyd? No, I can't. And then there was this clock bank tower. I have to take care of that as well, eventually. Who are you? Uh, yes. Let's see if there's something interesting. Woman who lives in clock bank voluntarily cleans the streets each day to keep the town beautiful. She scolds single factory workers with poor hygiene, sometimes even ordering them to wash their clothes or take a bath. Oh, okay. That's a good habit of sorts. So this is not the way up. Also, wait, wait, wait. Uh, what is that here? Hey. Catherine or Catherine? It was also a misunderstanding, but she's gone all the same. I can't imagine she's left town, but oh. Is this the end of us? No, no, no. I simply cannot accept this. She's my everything. Life is meaningless without her. Gods. Anyone. If you're listening, please. Please reunite me with my dear Catherine. Um, okay. Where is that? Where is she? He is defined by his love of Catherine, living only to follow her moods, obey her whims, devote himself to her body and soul. He is considered a hopeless case by those around him, but Catherine's happiness is his happiness too. Okay, then I guess I have to find Catherine, wherever, wherever she is. Hmm, that'll be interesting. Ah, anyways. So let's focus on pocket watches now. Time to make arrangements for my final major wear. Back to where all this began. Ores Rush. Do you want to sell silver in Ores Rush? I hope not. Oh, hey. <laughs> well, if it isn't my boy. Where have you been? Didn't even send your old pops a letter? Of course you couldn't. Now. What brings you back? <laughs> trade, what else, Pops? I've come with a business proposal yeah, for you. Yeah, trade, what else, Pops? Uh, I, as his Pops, I would I would immediately say, well, how about how about me? <laughs> yeah, dead is alive. A good one, I take it. Sure is. I'm setting up a shop that stocks the world's wares. Al Ron's department store is the name. I'm here to buy our finest sterling for sale on its shelves. Uh. Huh. Okay. Hmm. Sounds like an interesting enterprise. You got it, son. I'll part with Ors Rush's finest silver work for you. Okay, then let's buy this stuff. Fantastic. <laughs> Thank you kindly, Pops. There. I've got enough to stock all our shelves now. Time to head back to the shop and get ready to open. Okay, so, whoa. Okay, that looks much nicer now. Yeah, 
Things are heating up here. Time to report back to Alron and let him know the good news. Hmm. <laughs> I bet his jaw drop in surprise when he hears. Yeah. And let's bet who is uh, the suspicious stalker? Yeah, this one. That's hiding in plain sight and is looking sus as heck. I finally tracked you down, Particio. Huh? Finally tracked tracked me down. Uh, what does that mean? But okay, we will find out. As it will be a surprise, whatever the heck, or you know. Huh, what's this now? Hmm. Fog. Oh no! Is something burning? Weather's all wrong for a fog bank to roll on through. Yeah. Oh no! The house oh, is there. burning. Alron's manor's gone white as a ghost. No, no, what it's not burning. Nation's going on. Yeah, that's a good question. Okay, let's see. What is going on here? Ah, it's even misty inside. You feared it goes that way, yeah? It's fog, odd. It ain't right. Is there a fog monster? Dang, fog's everywhere. Master Particio. You all right? Stay with me, fella. Yeah, help him. Um, man, he appeared out of the mist with a strange device. He... he attacked me. With a strange device. Oh, does he have a weather machine? We could need a weather machine, you know. That's rotten. Where'd he go? To... Master Alron's room. I failed him. I should have stopped the intruder. Porticio, please. Yeah, yeah, of course. We are helping him. Leave it to me. I'll deal with that suspicious sneak. Hold yeah. on, Alrond. I'm coming. Let's see who that is. And if that is this sussy person that is sus. Yeah. Uh, Alrond! Porticio, stay back. There's something hiding in this fog. There, there is? It's too dangerous. Leave me. Run! Sorry, Alrond. I can't do that. I never turn my back when there's an enemy lurking about. Still, it's hot as high noon here. Yeah, so who is that guy? I could swear I've seen its lack before. Huh? When? Where? Oh! Okay. I, I got it. This ain't mist nor fog. It's steam. Uh. Does he have Why is there what? There's steam in here. Uh. Huh? Oh, ho, ho. some varmint sneaking around using the steam to hide, eh? Where is the engine that is producing the steam? I don't know who or what you are, but didn't your parents teach you any manners? Run? Also, don't know run. We're tactical care. retreat, yeah, but not run now. <laughs> I'm ready to fight. Come on. So let's see. Is it? Oh, is is it that? Uh, the guy from Oswald? And he has a steam engine in his pocket or what? Thinking time. Are you kidding me? Come on. That that is makes no sense. Okay, steam Let engine first. You. Okay, fire, it has 7500. Yeah! Um hmm. Let's try this one first. Ah, Okay, it takes normal damage, I think. Uh, I think it takes normal damage, so. There. 
<clears throat> so, and you are going to... Let's try this. Bonk. Ow. Okay. I need a play. Well then, let's fireball this Fire. thing. Burn. Here goes. Um, let's see, what can we do? What can we do? Here, Oswald, have fun. The tide is turning. It, oh, it does more damage now. Oh, that's not so good. Hmm. What could we do? What could we do? Well so, okay, we have that. And now we need fire. And we should be fine. Bonk. I'm terribly sorry, she says, in this room. Bring it on. So, okay. Uh, what else? I Let's use that. And, and... Stop playing hide and seek. Peek extra. I need a play. Feel my wrath. Fire. Oh, that should do damage. Oh, Yo, it did. So, who is this guy now? You're good. Thurston. Oh, I know you. Yeah, wasn't that that idiot You're from? Mr. Rock's employee. Yeah. Name of uh... my name's Thurston. You twit. You're as infuriating as ever. You idealistic bumpkin. Because of you, I, I... You... You got fired? Oh, that is deserved. I was fired. Yay! Rock gave me the axe. Me! Yeah, it's earned. I mean, you cannot do anything. Huh? He did? Except for being mean. You ruined my life, Articio. So I'll kill you and put a stop to your pathetic little business deal with Alrond. That will get me back in Rock's good graces. It has to. Wow. You are a lunatic. Got your britches in a twist, but I've never turned down a brawl. A word of warning. I never hold back in a fight, neither. Here I go. Well. I have a talent for making do. Then let's test a little bit out on him. No mercy. Only pain. No mercy, only pain. <laughs> that is so nice. So, enhances the infect. And let's see, what can we do? Extends the duration, puts target to sleep, reduces crit. Yeah, no, we just... some negative Not effect. Here, yeah, have fun. Nice! <laughs> now then. Some tricky mechanism, uh, I can deserve some empathy to them. You know, the, all the time that we know him, he always was, you know, he was always an ass. He was never even remotely friendly. So I'm sorry, but my sympathies are, um, for him specifically, are very limited. I'm investing in you. Sorry about that. Hmm. In pursuit of knowledge, feel my wrath. Pierce the winds of frost. Yo, <laughs> ten thousand damage. What to do? What to do? So, how about steam engine not uh, suited? Hmm? Uh, I don't get what you mean now. I'm sorry, I lo uh, you lost me. Uh, ah, one second. I just need Casty to rest a bit. So, okay, and she's healed. Fantastic. Time to shine. 
So, what can she do? She can do Poison Axe. Poison Axe is always good. Come. Oh, and he's weak to the axe. Fantastic. Oh, really? Okay, okay, I see what you did. Uh, let's see, what can we do about that? How about we ignore it? We just ignore it. Here, Oswald, have fun. Back on my feet. <clears throat> Feel my wrath! Pierce the wings of frost. I even miss him with magic. Whoa, Whoa look at that. Okay. That's new for me. Hmm. Okay, what do we do? What do we do? Rehabilitate is not working. Well, just dagger attacks. Hope for the best. Ow. Now then. That actually hurts. Why? Forgive me. There's no chance to miss this fireball if it explodes in the whole room. Well, apparently there is. Apparently there is. <laughs> so, okay, merchant skill. Uh, yeah, just this burn that thing down. Bonk. Da, da, da. Also, how nice of him to, you know, be like that, honestly. You were not nice to me because of you, I was fired. So I am going to do the reasonable thing and to kill you. I was like, what the fuck is your major malfunction? Damn it. Ow. Whoa, I'm out. Okay, merchant skill, more boosty points. I'm investing in you. That's cheating, you got no chance oh, to hit him in Fox. That's the idea of the <laughs> boss, yeah. It basically is. May your wounds be healed. You have healed. I think yes. it's like really just, you know, that's the whole idea. So, uh, in any case, let's focus. This will make it all right. That's a hope. So, everybody is full, and that it's guy is now. actually no real danger for us. At least he shouldn't be. So, let's get rid of that thing. Hey, that worked, but I cannot poison it. Hmm, why? That's so odd. So, in any case, um, it would be nice to get rid of it now. Fantastic. So. not well. Back to you, my guy. Yeah, I don't care if you're not well. Just fire elements at him. So, and you should have... Do you have anything that works here? Hmm. Yeah, you have this one. Also, he can kick him. <laughs> kick. Donk. That's a hope. Thinking time. Let me oh, whoops. Here we go. Bonk. Pierce the wings of frost. Hey, you're still alive. After so many so hard hits. I'm actually impressed. Not really, but still. A 
to poison. My turn. Nope, not this. Uh, this. Poison slash. New and improved. Another one. Uh, it is stronger. It's a different one. Ugh, are you kidding me? <sighs> okay. Let's try uh, ice first. Okay, it works not really. Daggers. Nope. Yeah, yeah, he's fine, he's fine. Just destroy that machine. No. Honestly, I'm a bit annoyed at this boss. That is... Uh, May your if that is his mechanic, it's a bit... Yeah. Eh. Don't like it. <laughs> I need a plan. Okay, let's try... Hitting it with the stuff. Yay! Staff works! Nice. Okay, what else? What else can we try? We can try... Yeah, we can try this. Nope. Then we can try spears. Nope. Okay. You forced my hand, he says. Um, what does that mean? Okay, what else? We have the bow! Missed. Damn it. Dagger. Um, that doesn't work. Fuck. Okay, just kick it. Me. Whoa, time out. So, and try the bow again. It does also not work. Oh, come on. Not well. Ah, let's Let analyze. I have to waste around darkness. That's not an element that I can really come with. I c we can try. Yeah. No mercy, only pain. Here. I'm terribly sorry. Fantastic. Hold your horses. Okay, now we have to... What can we do? What can we do? Uh... Dancer skills... I don't know the meaning of the word mercy. All for three turns. Here you go. Rest. Eh, uh, he will be fine. What to do? I still have healing touch. This will make it all right. Sorry about that. So, and Oswald should Time soon be able to do a lot of damage in one go. So, replenish health. No. So, and give him more damage. Yeah, I don't care. Nobody cares. So hopefully that works, as I think it does. Yeah, it hits everybody at the same time. <laughs> oh, that's evil. So. Okay, so that worked. So now we do the same thing again, Oswald. Sorry about that. No, you're Might. fine. So, because honestly, I, I know it's like a one-man show, but Oswald can in this moment do just most damage. So, it's my turn now. and you are going to... Hmm. Dancer skill, maybe this? Here we go. The winds of favor blow. Sorry. Oh, <laughs> oh, he was almost dead. I didn't know. <laughs> he was almost dead. I, I did not even notice that I put him in the red. Uh, we almost overcame like the third phase. I've been foiled. 
Yeah, I have been foiled. <laughs> you don't feel a lick of remorse for what you've done, do you? You know, he gets fired because of me for some reason. I have no idea why. And it's a logical assumption that he does. I should kill that guy. What the heck is your Listen, problem? The reason Mr. Rock gave you the boot was because you were playing dirty. Also, it's interesting that Particio uh, is really having like a lot of, you know, stalkers with that girl and him and probably soon another one. No, no. But I'm a forgiving sort, so let me give you a chance to set matters right. You're hired, fella, if you want the job. Excuse me? Of course, I gotta kick that offer down the line a bit. I don't have the funds to pay you yet. But once I buy the rights to the steam engine from Mr. Rock, you've got a place working for me. Wow, that is naive too. Okay, so Particio is trying, uh, is hiring his almost killer. Yo. What a joke. You don't really believe you can produce 80 billion, do you? Who knows for sure? Still, I believe I can do it. In the end, a person can't achieve nothing unless they got faith in themselves. <sighs> You're a man of unnatural tenacity. That's a talent. You'd make a good worker for sure. Just you wait a little while, Thurston. I promise the day will come when I can give you a job. I... Yeah. I admit defeat. Yeah, you don't have to admit anything. I defeated you fair and square in a very annoying fight. And also you tried to kill me. Say thank you. You? have a risk-friendly approach to life, don't you? Uh, I wouldn't say risk-friendly. I would say idiotic. But hey, that's just my opinion. <laughs> I don't doubt you'd hire anyone off the street, no matter their credentials or background. Yeah, that is... Everyone's a got a job they're suited for. Only problems figuring out what that is. I'm not sure that's a good approach, honestly. Oh, by the by, <laughs> I came to let you know how the store's doing. Oh? I've been eagerly awaiting news. How's business? <laughs> Try to keep your socks on, but... Whoa. That's a lot of people. Huh. Feast your eyes on this! A genuine clock bank pocket watch. As part of our opening sale, we're offering two for the price of one. Act now, they're going fast. I'll take one. Oh, me too, me too. Uh, this deal's gonna bankrupt me, but what the hey. Go on and take it, you thieves. Oh, my. That's also a, like a little word of advice. If any time a, a merchant tells you this is going to bankrupt me, it's the opposite. <laughs> he, they're still this making energy, a lot of money. This verve. Wellgrove has returned to the hustle and bustle of better days. Employ everyone, pay them fair money and you get no sucks or thieves. Uh, yeah, for the most part. What I would I would agree. Did you work to achieve this partitio? <laughs> simple. First magic spell was a simple policy. Sell high quality goods on the cheap. By centralizing the destination for our suppliers, uh, that's this place. We simplify logistics and enable transportation on mass. That lowers the cost of said transport, meaning we can sell better goods for cheaper. Spell number two, this department store itself. The convenience of having all these goods in one place means people stop by loads of stores and buy more, more, more. And that means Partitio invented the mall. Like he invented Walmart and stuff like that. So if you ever think Walmart is shit, 
That's Particio's fault. <laughs> it's short. We built the place so lots of folks can oh. and want to shop here. It's bound to make it livelier than a rodeo. These two simple ideas are what's generating all that energy. <laughs> that and a dash of passion. I wish my father could have been here to see this. Thank you, Particio. This more than proves your worth. As promised, here is my end of the bargain. 80 billion leaves. Yo, shit. <laughs> uh, wh what's this little thing? A check. A promissory note that you can exchange for legal tender. I figured it would be rather hard to carry around 80 billion in coin. Oh, it would be hard? Oh, tell me about it. Oh, good point. Hmm? If you are dissatisfied, I can throw some silk into the bargain. Uh, no, no, I, I trust you at your word, Alron. Oh, right. We should draw up a contract for this loan. I promise that I'll pay you back. I promise that you'll pay back. You want to pay him back 80 billion. Are you fucking crazy? Not necessary. You've already given me a down payment. But that's just my calling card. Single silver leaf. Indubitably. This is a symbol. A promise that no mere paper can equal. <sighs> Alron. Alrighty then. Time to swing on over to Mr. Rock's place and buy up that steam engine. If I may ask. Do you really intend to sign a deal with Rock? Oh, do you I also do not know? I expect a businessman of his caliber to simply hand over the steam engine willingly. Oh, you mean a cheater, a, a lie, a liar, a thief, a slaver. Yes, I don't, uh, I could not agree more. A word of warning. Do not trust that man, Particio. Yeah, not, not one bit. <laughs> you will do well to ponder how he will react to your proposal and plan accordingly. Uh, thanks for the warning, Alron. Much appreciated. P Particio? Hello there! Oh god, no, my other stalker. Yeah, Ori! Oh, seriously, where do you keep coming from? Not important. Have I got a scoop for you? Magnate Rock has released a proclamation! Huh? A big announcement is coming regarding the steam engine! Massive, earth-shaking! I still prefer physical money. You can pile them and repile and rest on them. <laughs> Very dragon-like, yes. Uh, suspicious timing. I <clears throat> what he's up to. Uh, hope he didn't get tired of waiting for me and made some wild play while I was out beating the bushes. Might as well head on over and see what all the fuss is about. Wait a sec. Does that mean you've collected the dough? <laughs> you could say that. <laughs> Big scoops are falling from the sky today. Wait until my brother hears about this. I believed in you from the start, Particio. I didn't. I still don't. <laughs> it wasn't finished yet. What? The proclamation will be made on Rock's very own private island. Rock Island. Mm-hmm. It's private property, so there are no ferries. You'll need a ship to get there. Yeah, no problem. I saw it already. Well, I already got my own vessel. It's a fine vessel, too. Purchased fair and square from Terra. And what do we have here? I mean, they take good photos of him. Traveling merchant Patricio makes cool 80 billion. Patricio continues to amaze with a challenge from the rock company in hand. He opened negotiations with fabulously rich, uh, wealthy noble Elrond. Moved by the merchant's passions, Orrond has agreed to act as financier. Will this desperate gamble to prevent the monopolization of the steam engine work? Read our next issue to find out.
Oh dear. Well, in any case, Rock will be forewarned now. Okay, so we got that done, I guess. Huh. So, uh, yeah, okay. That means it would be now, yeah, here. Chapter 4, level 45. Oy, 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 oy. So we have to train a little bit for that, but first off, let's go to Sai and see what there is. So, hmm. healing grape, curious antique. Uh, no. And you? Jerky rotten meat. Uh, no. Oh, and I got everything from him. Ah, one of the folks who keeps uh, the town running smoothly. He helps settle those who arrive and make it their home. Once a mercenary who fought for money, his outlook on life changed after losing his wife and child in the war. He now helps people make the most out of what precious time they have. Thank you. Okay. And easy inqu inquiries are probably helpful. <clears throat> so now is the question... By, by the way, uh, wait. No, not here? Huh? Here. Hey. Can't believe that bastard with my own father's sword. That sword is a precious, precious family heirloom. I won't be able to face my father without it. That dirty thief should be at the decaying temple in the eastern side sands, but I don't stand a chance against him. He probably knew as much, which is why let he let me live. Hmm. So that is, I remember what that is. It's like over here, but I cannot enter it. You only can enter it alone. Yeah, Eastern Sai Sands. You can only enter it alone, which I never am. So, hmm. So what does she have? Uh, nope, not worth it. I would like to do that, but really I'm just like, yeah, I, I can't, honestly. No clue how, or why, or when. Hmm. <laughs> well, in any case... Hey, Throny! So, um, we are basically, yeah, with the same party. Let's hear another story of Agnia. She makes her way to the town of Sai, a place her mother once performed. She enters the town in search of someone who might remember her mother. Well then. Let's check what's going on here. So this is Sai, the town where Mama performed. Giselle was here not long ago, so perhaps someone knows something. Excuse me. Is something the matter, miss? Would you happen to know of a dancer who was here about 20 years ago? Oh my, 20 years is quite a long time. This place has changed so much since then. Perhaps you should check the old quarters in the east. I will, thank you. Okay. Oh, there was also this thing where I cannot enter, which I absolutely do want to do. <laughs> oh my. Is that... That pose looks just like... The moon step. Oh my god. She gets the moon be... step. She's Michael Jackson. way old lady old wait is agnia not like 17 or 18 or something what the heck take this and that and one of these lol <laughs> that ought to do it lila what are you doing 
We've had just about enough of your mischief. And to make matters worse, you've defiled Mother's statue. I think she looks better this way. That statue is a symbol of our hope. Like that matters in this town. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty hopeless, like uh, the we way have it looks. No money, no good food, nothing. There's no hope for us here. You brat. This gloom doesn't suit a desert town at all. But I know a way to brighten up the place. What are you doing? Oh, she's dancing. Watch me shine. For seven years old, Agnia is old. Um, hmm. I mean, still. I don't know what that was, but I think you'd best be on your way. And clean yeah. up that statue, Lila. Yeah, people don't take dances without music. I'm, I'm like, okay. Well was that just now? You were spinning around so much it made me dizzy. It was a dance. Was it your first time seeing one? A uh, dance? Uh, you cannot tell me they are unfamiliar with the term of dances. Lila. You cannot tell me Don, that. Gramps found me. Like that's bullshit. I am sorry. And honestly, Agnia, you need music. Oh, that girl sure can run. She'll come home when she's hungry. More importantly, that was a beautiful dance, young lady. Th thank you. It seems the other townsfolk didn't quite agree, though. Nonsense. You were a sight to behold. You must be tired from your journey. You're free to rest your feet at our house, Miss... Uh... Please, call me Agnia. But are you sure? We certainly are, Agnia. In fact, we insist... After all, something about you feels uh, familiar. And they know their mother. Of course, lucky. <clears throat> ay, ay, ay. Angel ring. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, a carpenter, an apprentice carpenter bringing, brimming with vigor. He is courting the woman working at the tavern, whose life circumstances force her to toil without a day's respite, and wants to make, journey, uh, make a journeyman as soon as he can to be there for her propos, prosperity. <laughs> oh god. Okay, I cannot read anymore. Uh, what is the travel banter saying? Oh no. What's the matter, Agnia? Well, you see, I stumbled when practicing in your step, and... What? Let me have a look. It's a minor sprain. Hold still while I treat it, okay? You're too kind, Casty. Thanks for always taking care of me. Huh. You don't need to thank me, so how does it feel? Much better, thanks to you. Now I can keep practicing. Don't push yourself too hard, you hear? I wouldn't want you to sprain it again. Got it, Mama. <laughs> Mama? <laughs> I I'm sorry, Casty. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay, now. And Proticio. Buy some candy with this, son. The name's Proticio. Here, take this. Hey, Proticio, why do you give a coin to everyone you meet? It's a mercantile investment. I want folks to remember my face. But isn't it a lot of money? Yes, my money. By the way. Ha! I don't mind. You should. I can throw fireballs. The devil, called pervert, uh, the devil called poverty taught me to, uh, the weight of a single leaf. So I'm happy to lighten the burden of others, even if it's just a little. That's wonderful. I'm sure you made a lot of people smile that way. 
a real shining star, Patricia. I'm apt to float off and join in the big blue with how light my coin purse is. Even your coin purse is a star. <laughs> um, yeah, okay. Oswald says nothing. Oswald thinks that whole thing is stupid, probably. <laughs> What's there? So, what do we have here? Townsperson. Uh, a woman who spends her day loitering in the town square. Her face betrays no emotion whatsoever. She's quite considerate, however. She hands out snacks to the children in the afternoon. Silently, of course. It's a mite creepy. What does she have? A stuffed toy. Okay. <clears throat> and a new item. Some shiny. A tough nut. Oh, nice. We need nuts. Physical defense. Uh, I guess Potisio can deal with that a bit. So, and this one, yeah, is for later. Do -do -do. Wait, what is with that kit? Handkerchief, not for sale. The old of two siblings with living with an elderly couple in town. The war robbed them of their parents, and so they find themselves among the orphans of the couple's care. The shock and upheaval of all uh, of it all has caused this young girl to close herself off from the world. She hardly speaks to anyone that these days. And another shiny item. Um, where is it? Is it? It's here. Okay, it's inside somewhere, I guess. What the? That are not all your your children or stuff like that. That can't Thank be. Thank you. Were you good boys and girls while we were out? Who are all these children? I think that's an orphanage, but it's the first normal looking orphanage, They're I young guess. Ones from all over <clears throat> town. We watch over them when their parents can't. There aren't many jobs to be had here, so their parents leave in search of work. Is she a new friend? Um, okay, she's dancing for the children. Oh, that's amazing! Okay, as long as they like it. <laughs> she's a traveling dancer. It's a kindergarten, yeah, it is. You're all too young to know, but another dancer visited this very town 20 years ago. Oh, how lucky that you remember especially she that was right a now. a hearted woman named Kwani. Th that was my mother! Oh, it's no wonder you felt familiar. You look just like her. It makes me happy to hear that you remember her. As if we could forget. Kwani was only passing through, yet gave from her own pockets to help us. She took care of us like she was our own mother. The townsfolk built a statue of her so that they'd never forget the hope she gave us. So that statue is of my mother. I can't tell you how happy that makes me. She met a little orphan girl while she was here. And she taught her how to dance. That little girl never stopped dancing. And now she's famous for it. Wait, is that uh, the woman that is evil and super famous and we a don't know yet answer? that she's evil? That one? Pardon me. A bodyguard. Oh, fantastic. I thought I told you to leave. Huh? You again? No matter how many times you come around, our answer won't change. This town is all we have left. This is our home. I beg you to reconsider. 
I've seen her before. We paid a lot of money for this land. Which makes you no more than trespassers. My liege was gracious enough to give you time to leave. But no longer. I will force you out if I must. Stop! I won't let you lay a finger on my parents. Lila! Get lost, you big oaf! Don't you have someone else to bully? I can't imagine what you'd want with a garbage heap like this! <laughs> How nice. Let the others know there will be no mercy next time. Yeah, what? No mercy? Do you want to cut down children? Really? Do you, you want that on your resume? I guess she wants that on her resume. Nice woman. Love her. Thank you, Lila. Lila. Didn't I tell you already? There's no hope for us here. Lila. Did she run away again? At a time like this? You spoil her too much, Platt. <sighs> Lila was an orphan. She was abandoned when she was little, so we took her in and raised her as our own. Means they kind of not care about resumes around here. <laughs> um, yeah, it seems so. But her heart's been closed off ever since, and all she ever does is make mischief around town. She always says that there's no hope. Here. I mean, look around. I tend to agree. I wish we knew how to make her happy. <sighs> I have to do something. I have to find Lila. Well then. So, first things before we go on is look at whip. the shiny. Yeah, shiny. A stuffed toy! Hey, it's money. <laughs> so, and let's check him. Let's inquire an old man who runs the orphanage. Da 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 da. So, herb. Oh, a nut! Yo, thanks. Much so, and you? I cannot do anything, but you have a healing grape punch. Oh, nice. Thank you. Very helpful. Much appreciated. Okay. Um, so then is a question what's uh, behind this. Hmm. I still don't know, but I really want to know. A light coin pouch nullifies random augmenting effects. Hmm. A woman who spends every waking moment of her day in some form of toil. By day she is her provisioner, by night she works at the tavern. All her pace goes to treatment for her father's war wounds. But she hides her own suffering well behind a cheerful smile. Many of the townspeople are privately cheering for Thank her. You. Okay. And you? Medicine peddler. Well now. A medicine seller who visits the town on a regular basis. As an old friend of the elderly couple looking after several of the children in town, he sells them his medication at a discount. He's actually in the final stages of a terminal disease. But it's not the dying that bothers him, it's a regret that he won't be here to help the townsfolk any longer. Hmm. Wow. That went dark very quickly. <laughs> <coughs> So, um, apart from that, I think we're good. And we, there is some cool item somewhere. Let's find it. Oh, there's Lila. Okay. 
It's Birting Plum. Yay. So, Lila, now tell me why this statue is so annoying for you. What am I doing? Nothing uh, good. Soon this town will be nothing but a memory. And a bad one at that. There was never anything fun to do here. That's part of growing up. Uh, sadly. Fun. So that was a dance. And punk. <laughs> <laughs> it's just uh, where everybody can see you. Uh, don't worry. Uh, what? What are you staring at, you idiot? No. <laughs> Just admiring your moves. I'm happy to see you've taken a liking to dance. N no, I haven't. <laughs> I can teach you if you like. What do you say, Lila? Yeah, teach her. Uh, what? That kid has some promise. Uh, she just needs. Yeah. You can't dance in those. Some positivity in her life. Which means I'll just have to find you a new pair. <coughs> Hey! Hmm. I didn't even agree to dance with you! Never you worry about that. Just wait here, okay? <coughs> hey. What's up with that lady? And now we... Ah, uh, we... What? A treat for someone for shoes. <laughs> okay. Hey, Oswald! La la la. Why are you singing? It happens when I'm in a real good mood. I don't understand. Then why don't we do it together? No, thank you. Alright, I don't mind singing on my own. I must be on my way. But goodbye I shall not say. For you and I will meet again someday. Hmm. Oh, I saw your foot moving to the beat. Uh, it did not. <laughs> oh, that's cute. No, I don't like music. How dare you? I'm Edge. I'm Lord of Edges. <laughs> oh, dear. Hmm. <coughs> so, cute shoes. Thank you. Then let's show them to Lila. In the night. There is nothing that can happen in the night. It's nothing bad. They're warming up Oswald's dead heart. Yes, his cold dead heart. It's so cold and so dead. So, oh, would you look at that? Money, money, money. <coughs> So, here, Lila. They fit perfectly! Thank goodness. I guess they do. Now then, let's begin. Just follow me. Your turn. Fine. There's no need to get so excited. <laughs> Bonk. Oh. Are you crazy? There's no way I can do something like that. This is called the moon step. It's an advanced move, but Yeah, uh Agnia, you should start with the basics. That's a kit. What? No, you can do it, Lila. I get it now. You just want to laugh at me, don't you? Not. Well, Oswald probably wants to. When I saw your moves, <laughs> I knew. You've got the makings of a dancer, Lila. <clears throat> I do? But when you start, you don't need to worry about doing it well. 
You just need to have fun. That's the most important part. Fun. Yeah, fun. <laughs> Come on, let's give it another try. <clears throat> After some time. Okay. Now there is what happens when things go wrong, that was I guess. Amazing! You dance wonderfully, Lila. <sighs> That's the first time anyone's ever praised me so much. <laughs> Thank you, Lila. Huh? What are you thanking me for? It made me happy to see you have fun. D don't be ridiculous. <laughs> Wouldn't you be happier if I could do the moon step? Huh? When I watched you dance, all the bad thoughts in my head disappeared. And my heart felt warm. Oh. <laughs> What's wrong with me? Yeah, that's uh, the first step out of depression into happiness. Lila. Let's hope, my dear. Oh. What do you say we do it one more time, Lila? Yeah, I knew it. You, Miss Kwani. <coughs> so Dolcinea is from here. Every dancer knows every dancer, I guess. I decided someday I'm going to be a star. Now it's just a question, why is Dolcinea evil? Even though we don't know it yet. But she's probably evil. I mean, we saw it. <laughs> At least as players, I don't know. That was a beautiful <laughs> dance, Lila. It reminded me of Dolcinea. Dolcinea? You mean the little orphan girl that my mother taught was? That's right. Her name was Dolcinea. She used to practice here all night with your mother. I'm happy you found yourself a good teacher, Lila. Uh. Dolcinea said she was going to be a star, and now she is. But not everyone here is happy about that. After all, when it came to the townsfolk, that girl... Hmm? Come quickly! The town's in trouble! Uh... What? I'll go check Finally! It out. Trouble! I love I'm trouble! With you. Let's go! Let's see what stupid stuff they are doing. Probably hitting children, as I ex uh, expect them. <clears throat> what do you think you're doing? I told you there would be no mercy next time, didn't I? Stop this madness! This town is our... Yo. Dolcinea? 
In this dress and this clothes and this hair. Okay. Greetings, you poor little slum dwellers. Allow me to free you from your film. I don't care if you're a star, the moon, or the whole damn sky. You need to come back down to Earth and remember where you came from. Oh, I don't... I think she is past that point. Unfortunately for you, my memory just isn't what it used to be. Now go, Veronica. I will be watching the show from atop the hill. Understood. this happening hmm no I can worry about the wise after I put an end to this yo let's hit some people let me help I've got to teach these bullies a lesson I can tell how much you care for everyone Lila but you have to leave this to me and to You're Oswald kids to safety you hear? <laughs> Magnia. So, okay. and, uh, what's about uh, wait me. a minute, Earth? What do you mean? Good luck, Agnia. Let's fireball them. Yeah, that's sure. <laughs> I won't let you down. Hmm? Go to Dolcinea. What is? Huh? Okay. I thought I uh, I solved the situation here, but apparently I don't. Apparently I just go here. Hey, I heard voice and it was like, wait Bring a minute. Yeah, that was like, you know, her. So, but anyways. Uh, yeah, we are going to give all boost points to I'm Oswald. So, he's carrying the team as usual. Sorry about that. Now. Now then. Calculations complete. So, and that Fire. should be the end of it Burn. if everything goes good. Ah, almost. Time to shine. So, and you can use this. Oh, nice. Well now. My journey will not end here. So, but I wonder, like, Dolcinea, she has some evil plans. That for, that much we do know. What does she want in her hometown? That doesn't make a lot of sense. At least as far as I know. Now then. Now then, hey guys. How about you get a fireball? Here, have fun. Yo. <laughs> Yeah, Oswald is high. <laughs> Oswald has a high level, that's true. So, uh... Here's a puff for you. Uh, that it's is not a lot of damage. Uh, let's try with her. Oh, yay, that worked. He's level 55! <laughs> Oswald is a menace now. Like, everybody's catching up a little bit, but Os since Oswald is always in the team, that's like, uh, that's what I talked about. Um, because I think I will do Oswald's story last, because I think uh, Oswald is a protagonist and I cannot put him out of the team. So it might be, I might be wrong, but it might be that Oswald, when Oswald uh, finishes his story, his story just ends you know the game ends because it's then like yeah uh, you have done it uh, well done or something he's 20 levels ahead of the party yes <laughs> he is and honestly I tried to level them up okay I tried to have them evenly leveled but it's kind of hard okay strike them down Bring it on. So, you are going to yeah, attack everybody. You Slip, donk. 
Fantastic. Time to divvy up the earnings. So then we can save here. Fantastic. Oh look, look <laughs> that uh how long is that ago? 30 hours. <laughs> 30 hours. 30 hours, 30 levels. Fantastic. So, and since there is probably an boss battle coming, let's give Particio some plums. And I think we're good to go. Hello. Oh, wait. One second, I'm with you in a second. Here you go. Donk. So, and you are going to... Uh, oh, here. Hmm. hmm. Yeah. Okay, I've good. gained valuable insight. So, um, one thing that I wanted to check on jobs here, Oswald. No, uh, well, skills. The support skills for Oswald. Like he has this rise again, once per battle. So elemental attack by fifty. Um, Raises the amount of latent power. I'm thinking about putting Vigorous, Vigorous Victor away. Because Oswald is pretty fine on that. If I have something better. But I'm not sure actually. Like I could give him more SP. Or I could give him more experience. You know. Um... Maybe, maybe that is a good idea, because I have nobody that has extra experience, so... Yeah, let's do that. You know, for leveling up. So, well then, Dolce Nea! Found you. Probably I have to deal with her bodyguard well, this well, time. If it isn't the little dancer from before. Have you come for an autograph? You must be quite the fan to come all the way out here just to see me. I'm not here for an autograph. Far from it. I came here to stop you from destroying that town. Unfortunately for you, I have big plans for this place. It is to become Dolcinea Land. <coughs> What? D Dolcinea land? What the heck is that supposed to be? It has quite the nice ring to it, no? No, no, absolutely not. No, it uh uh. It would be a mm -mm. shining paradise built in honor of the realm's finest superstar. This is a war torn land. Why would you think I'm that is a good idea? These people something they can be proud of. They should be thanking me. But isn't this your hometown? <sighs> your jokes bore me, little girl. Dulcinea? <sighs> ah. This is no home of mine. Uh, I hit something. I hit a nerve. Oh no. My very first memory is of sand. Everywhere I looked. I can't even remember my parents' faces. I was abandoned here. Yeah, your parents probably Life died in a war. Was miserable. Yeah, that happens in a war-torn land. Like, what the fuck is she... Dressed mm. in flea-ridden rags, scavenging for food. Maybe with both? Yeah, I'm, I would be fine with that. But one day, an opportunity presented itself. A dazzling light descended upon this gloomy, destitute town. Is she s telling me that, or is she sh just thinking that? Upon her brilliant figure as she danced. She was a star. 
that's when I decided to prove myself to the world. After some time, I became a dancer and found myself in front of a grand stage during my travels. I wish to dance upon it. So I worked harder than anyone. Until I outshone them all. Okay, so she's an anime main character. Dazzling stairs to success. Yeah, and you forgot where you came from. That is not a good story, my guy. Do you see now? I am without a doubt the realm's finest superstar. I trained every day of my life so that my glow would never die. How could the world's most beautiful, shining star come from this depressing slum? It's simply not possible. Which is why I say this is no home of mine. Yeah, sounds like Disney lol, yeah. Pretty much. Ah. It doesn't matter. Yeah. It really doesn't matter. It doesn't matter where you come from. A true star would never cause others pain. A true star is that's quite enough. Duh. Yeah, enough positivity. <laughs> This area needs to be cleared. Eh, no. Once it's gone, all memory of it shall follow. Ugh. She's an, she's an enemy main protagonist and she's sad. And that's why other people have to suffer. Oh my god. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> you stubborn little girl. You should know that such obstinance will only get you hurt. Yeah, so try me. Veronica, get rid of her. You can try, but I won't let you lay a finger on this town. Wait for me, Lila. Oh, look. Uh, now then. So honestly, we are a bit at the wrong place for that. But in any ways, let's do this. Like, if we would have want to stop that, we should be, you know, down in the town and help. But hey, okay. So, let's see. Let's see if Oswald can do something with that. Sorry about that. So, and let's see if there's something else than fire that I can use. Oh, ice! Oh, that is a bad choice. <laughs> what to do? What to do? Oh, here, have fun. So cool Be broken. Bonk. Thank you, Casty. Okay, then let's see. We give Oswald a little power up, Not and that. then he can have fun. Bonk. No. So, that was at least 7,000 damage. <laughs> at least. So. I'm investing in you. Sorry about that. Well, now. These hands. Poison slash. Oh hey, I have a cool idea. What if main characters will be big as well in their end quest? <laughs> that would be fun. So what did she do? Switch gears. She has... What? More shield points? Um, I mean, if you think so, that is going to help uh, have fun with that. But that is not going to help. Bring it on. 
Like, she has two weaknesses against Oswald's elements. I can't just put everything into him. That is, uh, yeah, the best thing that I can do right now. I have a talent for making do. So, let's see. Raises. Do I have something? Um, nullifies. Raise elemental defense. Affects action order. No. Oh, here you go, Oswald. Your so, no, he got what? Oh, he got only that power up. Okay. I had hoped for a little bit more. Calculations complete. Indulge me for a moment. You're broken. Great job, Oswald! So, uh, let's see. Poison axe. That's I always good. Oh. <laughs> Here I go. Poison slash. Veronica did not even attack us yet. <laughs> We're just killing her. I just noticed that. She she did not do anything. The tide is turning. No, thank you. Indulge me, Okay, what is that? Featherweight. Is that a counter? Can she counter? Untouched boss fight. Uh, would have been nice, honestly. Would have been really nice. <laughs> but I think that's impossible with uh, how much health bosses have. But still, <laughs> that it, it's yeah. Poison slash. It's evasion. Ah, well, that will not help a lot. Forgive me. So. You're a star, Agnia. Um, Partitio, what do we do with you? Uh, da -da, da -da. For some reason, I really like it when Cassie said, like, she's always so nice, but if you power her up totally and she says with this deadly earnesty, these hands. <laughs> That's really like, I, I like that for some reason. Probably because it shows a little bit of darkness in her all niceness. Also, my enemy is now eight rounds poisoned. I don't think that she will survive that long. Indulge me, Oh my god! How much damage was that? That was at least 12,000. Yeah, we don't care. So, here you go. Stand up. No mercy, only pain. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's really her fault. So, and let's see, what else do you have? Take the ah! <laughs> Patricio killed his first hey, boss! Apart from the uh, the tutorial boss. Hey! <laughs> Patricio killed his first boss. Oh, I'm so proud of you. <laughs> Congrats. I failed. 
Yeah. You, wish to get you failed so to hard. Spotlight, I see. You are too kind. Take a moment to catch your breath, Veronica. So, you're next. Let's go. I must confess, you put on quite the show. There is something special about you, Agnia. Something rare that not all dancers have. You have a glow about you. Dulcinea, stars are meant to... Put smiles on people's faces, yes? <laughs> what nonsense. I dance to prove myself to the world, to gain the people's recognition. Well done, I, I guess. I only of my own happiness. <sighs> You're Kwani's daughter, aren't you? I suppose you're faithfully following her teachings, then. Well, they are, they are very naive, but they are better than yours. <laughs> you're such a fool. Though I cannot deny even the smallest bit of interest in you. Is this an invitation? The festival of... Greece. It's the main event of the Grand Gala. Very few dancers have the privilege of performing in it. We can settle this there. The crowd will decide which of us is the true star. That's fine with me. Well, <laughs> there will no... I look forward to it already. I think after the fight there will be no stage left. <laughs> because then, it's probably going to be some sort of fight. In your hands. We're leaving, Veronica. Tonight's show was brought to you by me, Dulcinea Lucille. I shall await you on the stage. Wow, what a bitch. Tolchinea's gone. Yup. I can't thank you enough, miss. I'm just glad everyone's all right. Oh no. Look. What now? Mother's statue. It's in pieces. Oh, they did that? Oh. Why? That's so stupid. That's so mean. And useless. We just built another one. Our hope. <laughs> Lila. What's wrong with all of you? Don't you get tired of being gloomy all the time? Uh, you are speaking you here. About, Lila? If you're looking for hope, it's right here. I... I'll be your new hope. Lila. Hmm. I mean, that's nice and all, but if before you get rich and can help people, that takes some years. We need help kind of now, you know? Lila! She's dancing. I can't believe it. Ouch! Lila! Oh, <laughs> 
Thank you, Agnia. You helped me discover something important. Were you able to find something too? I was. I found... Hmm. What did we find? A mother's love? No. The joy of dancing? Oh, we had that. The power of determination? I guess that's most fitting. <laughs> Let's go with that. Really? <laughs> I'm glad it wasn't just me then. When I dance, my heart feels warm. All the bad thoughts in my head disappear. And I'm filled with happiness. <sighs> Those are beautiful words, Lila. <laughs> From now on, I'm going to share this happiness with the whole town. Thank you, Lila. Again? What are you thanking me for? I should get going. Okay, well that is solved, I guess. I mean, it's a very hopeful story, but on the other hand, I'm pretty sure those people need not dance, they need money and food and stuff. Well, ah, in the town of Sai, Agnia uncovers the memories her mother left behind. A superstar despairs over her past, while a young girl hopes for the future. The traveling dancer keeps her stories close to her heart as she makes her way to the Grand Gala. Well, okay. I think we are, like, uh, at the final stories of everyone. It feels a lot like it, because a lot feels like, you know, final confrontation coming for many characters. <clears throat> but where is the Grand Gala? That's now the question. Where is it? Hmm... Terminus, uh, Throne, End of Commerce. Oh, there! Merry Hills. Okay. Work, better homes, food, end of war. Yeah, they kind of need all of that. <laughs> More or less all of that. So, okay. Now, what I want to do, I know it will sound crazy, is uh, we have to, we have finished those two stories. I wanted to do that today. So, and now I really want to level up uh, my uh, remaining characters here so that they have the appropriate level. Because when we look at that, it's a bit, you know, <laughs> very different, you could say. Um, so, I think we take Casti, Agnia and Particio a bit on a leveling cruise. Um, though I am not certain yet where to. So, as it seems, we could just go outside and, you know, we could check here what's with this, uh... Yeah, where we only can enter alone, which I still don't understand. As it has something to do with the story of uh, Hikari, which I'm not sure anymore, or something else.
getting warmed up. Um, uh, he has nothing that's effective right now. There you go. I'm investing in you. That's a hope. I need a play. So, and I hope that I somehow can do something there. I don't think so. So, fantastic. So, at least I want to get those guys level 40. That would be nice. Hello. So, let's scrutinize him. What was with him? An emaciated man drawing nervous, wrecked breath. He calls out to passerby to purchase his wares. Shuffles off to replenish his stocks when he sells out. Where exactly his products come from is unclear. Mm hmm. That stuff is really expensive. I take that, but nothing else. Thank you. Thank you can. Like, who? No, no, no. Okay, but yeah, let's level up. Let's find out if we can enter this temple in the east somehow. It's just like this, you can only enter alone, and I'm just sitting there, ye how? Hmm. Also, that are some weird apes. Um. Pierce the winds of frost. Whoa. Okay. Two of them are gone. That makes it easier. Uh. So, yay! Agnia does some damage too already. Double. Nice. Get back up. That's a good development, actually. I like it. So. Now let's check if we can enter here now or not. I suppose not, but, you know, checking costs nothing. That's the wrong way. Life is too precious to risk. Oh, that's a... Uh, that's an interesting mix. <laughs> Here. I'm investing in you. That's a hope. What to do? What to do? And you are going to... Do some damage. Oh, that's not a lot. At least it's not as much as now. I hoped. Uh, dancer skills... I need a plan. Feel my wrath. Indulge me for a moment. Hmm. I've seen worse methods. Okay. Um. No. But I'm actually uh, quite, you know, stumped on. Oh, there's nothing here. Uh, is some something here? Nope. Or right in front? Nope. Also. So we have to be alone to enter. That is st something that I still don't get. No plan, only fireball. Exactly. You know it. Okay. That did not work. I thought it's enough. <laughs> uh, let's try. Let's see if it's maybe enough. Oh, it was, actually. Nice. Thank you. So. Come alone if you wish to pass through the gate. I have absolutely no clue. I cannot come alone. That is just not a thing. In this game. I, I have no clue what to do with that. <sighs> so, um, well, okay. I have no clue with that and I'm not staying uh, to find out eventually. Maybe. So, uh, what I want to do instead. So we go to Cragridge 
And there was like, I remember there was a hole or, you, you know, something there, a dungeon. And maybe we can check out what is going on there. Even though that is a very creepy town, just saying. You know, I am judging hard that this town is filled with murderers and dark mages. To dismiss a party member, I don't think so. Settings. Um, here is uh, console dash. Nope. Travel banter world map. Zoom in. Nope. There's nothing. Radar, battle tactics, Oswald's uh, di different paths, summoning latent powers, reputation, da 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 da. Nope. Nope, there's nothing. I don't know. When you change them. Um, yeah, we could try that. Then it would be actually hard to get there. You know, like alone. I probably would go with Oswald just because, you know. I have to go alone. I'm the strongest. Only I can do it. Something like that. <laughs> so. You've got talent, Patricia. Poison slash. Has to be done. Or maybe at Final Cave you need to complete everyone's quest. That might be a thing too. Might be. Again, I, I have no clue. I don't know. So, anyways, Oop, nope, that's not the way. Um, wait, did I mess that up? Hey, the customer. No. Huh, that is a very aggressive uh, bowl. Strike them down. I guess the red horns are not just for show. Yeehaw! Though I hope they are. Slip, it's my turn now. Nope. Ooh. Ow. My turn. And I'm stunned. Holy shit, he stunned me. Okay, everything is good. Me. Final cave. No. No, this is not the way. Where is it? How did I get here? Not on the left. Did I get here on the right? Oh yeah, I did. Ah, oh, on the right side. I remember this way. No. no. So, whoop, that was the wrong thingy. And here we go. Have a flashlight. Now then. So, and you can. She has nothing that helps here. Uh, a touch of poison. So, and you can. Oh, you have a spear. Fantastic. Here you go. <clears throat> so do, 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 do. good and yeah here west of that there was this cave that was broken and holy shit oh well, that's unfortunate for you to have these elements as a weakness. I'm investing in you. Thank you. Ow. I need a plan. Feel my wrath. 
Indulge me for a moment. Oh, you're still alive. That's unfortunate. It's my turn now. How dare you to be alive? Maybe well. next time. So. So, but actually it seems Oswald still needs SP. God, look, I have 24,000 journey points just on hold. <laughs> oh, dear God. I don't need them. But I have them. So. Yeah, I get... Hmm. I take this out because it's Oswald. And I give him this... Um, vigorous Victor. So. He never runs out of stuff. So, okay. Hello, Urk. That's not very helpful. That's also... What's that? Race elemental defense reduces? No. Hmm. A new construction worker whose greatest concern is not bothering anyone. He saves all the days, reports and messages, then relays them once a day through. He also avoids bringing up anything that would make the workers uncomfortable. This is precisely why, despite being the first to spot the monster at the site, he never mentioned it to anyone. Dude, you are an idiot. Unfinished tunnel level 33. That is just what I need. What? So, the overseer of this construction site. He has never seen one of his projects through to completion and has earned the respect of his workers. He... Ah, uh, no. He's seen every. Not one. <laughs> None. He thinks of their safety above all else and outright refuses any project he considers too dangerous. And he has that and that. Uh, don't care. Let me through. It's dangerous up ahead. I cannot let anyone pass. Good night. Good night. So. Hi. I'm going to fuck things up. No, 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 no. You cannot be in here. Uh, just what is that guard out there doing? Uh, I don't care. He's sleeping. I don't know why. There's a monster lurking in the depths of these mines. I gathered up some folks to try and chase it off, but... Oh, it has eaten all of them? Not a single one comes back. Oh dear. I get a feeling they might never. No one stands a chance against that beast. I do. You best get out of here as quick as you can. I promise I won't think worse of you for it. Ugh. I'm the Lord of Edges. I can do that. And easily at that. So... Rock Cleaver. Hmm, okay. Thanks, thanks. So, let's get stuff. Let's get stuff and find this monster and then let's bully it. What the fuck are you? I'm just getting warmed up. So, I have no idea what you are. I don't care to know. The tide is turning. Now then. Now then. Let's have some fun with you guys. Ancient Birdian. Okay, so now you know how they look when they get old. They become ugly. Yo, two are down. <laughs> and three. That was easy. So, okay. Do, do, do. Let's find this evil man-eating monster and let's find out that the evil man-eating monster actually was not the problem, it was the humans. I'm just guessing, what the fuck is that in the it's background? Is it a mole that turned to stone? It's. I think it's a mole that turned to stone. And a wild mole. Hmm. Okay. Indulge me for a moment. Here goes. So here goes, and you are going to 
Hmm. How about you, dagger? Head dance. Donk. Nice. My turn. Poison slash. It has to be done. My journey will not end. So. Um, then let's see. How do we get that shiny over there? Because I kind of need uh, that shiny to have. Huh? Um, hmm. Oh, they are all vulnerable to, to sticks. All of them. And sticks are usually a uh, one hit. <laughs> uh, damn it. Up there. Yeah, I know. It's... Uh, it does... Uh, no. I'm pretty sure the weight doesn't go that, like that. Pretty sure. Strike them down. You're finished. Okay. That was problem number one solved. And problem number two is following soon. No, it's not. What the heck? Okay. Yeah, no, up there. It's just... Hmm. That's not the way. I think. Or is it? Ah! No, it's not. But here's something. 13,000. Nice. Let the experiment begin. And more bird monsters. You are different bird hmm. monsters. Okay. Don't care. Here. Have something in your face. Whoa. <laughs> Just deleted them. Damn, Perticio, you're catching up. That's nice to see. So down there, there's also something. Yes, uh, you come from that ladder. Yeah, that's what I am pretty sure I will do or should do. Ah, here. Are you my next patient? I'm just getting warmed up. So one like that. So and one like uh, sweeping cleaver. Here you go. Damn it! But Oswald has nothing to do anymore. Um, but still, here. Yeah. See, but <laughs> first hit always. Oh, he kills with the first hit on elemental barrage t way too often. So, because, yeah, you have this, a clarity stone, whatever the heck that is, prevents confusion. Okay. Um, also skills, uh, someone has unlocked something. Oh, you. Nice. Okay. And... Yeah, everybody has unlocked everything. Cool. And I cannot go through this? Damn it. Um, where did I come from then? Hmm. Oh, that's a big and ugly bird. No. King Condor. Uh -huh. And you are all still alive. How dare you? It's my turn now. So. Okay, good. Um, so it's not from that ladder then. I have to assume. But how do I get there? Hmm. Hmm. I'm very confused. Slip, 
Hmm. Strike them down. Okay, and the last one. Get him down. Finally. So, hmm. Okay, it's not there. Then let's go here. So, uh, down there I can see the people. Okay, I have to figure out a way. Herb elixir, fantastic. And, whoa. What are those guys? Birds? Is a... Huh? Are those birds that are still in the eggs and birds that just came out of the eggs? I'm in you. It looks like that. That's a hope. It's my turn now. My axe is sharp. Catch me. Yeah. Seems like it. Feel my wrath. Two-handed hatchling, crawly fledgling. Honestly, why are you attacking me? You should run from people like me. <laughs> Fire. Burn. Bonk. Okay. Well, I've seen worse at least it gives some sort of food, I guess. So, okay. Let's save. Whoop. Okay, and let's save this guy. Yes, I want to proceed. Hi! The fuck? Wow. And confusion and sleep and what did I get? What did I get? I, I think I got everything. Okay. Okay, we have to nullify status ailment. Ailments? Is it every? I'm not sure. I'm trying one. So, medical concoction. Da, da, da. The fuck? So, okay, let's try. Confusion. Like, that's everything. Sleep. That Oswald got everything. Oswald got sleep, confusion, blindness. And poison like wow what the fuck is that kind of creature and it cures only one ailment oh you're kidding me okay i thought it can't cure us all really yeah yeah Cassie is right really now. okay uh we have to do both again Relief, uh, cleansing. So, let's try again. Bring it on. And Oswald has still confusion. Oh my god. Okay, let's see. What can we do? What can we do? Extends the reach of a single ally's skills to all. For three turns. Uh, or here. Pay a single foe. How about or required a 30,000? Oh god. Wait, what was that called? Many Maws. I mean, okay, it's a name, I guess. Ah, damn it, what do we do? What do we do? Curse elements one. Yeah, I thought like it means it's one of them of these things and not like, yeah, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I was apparently wrong. So let's try if it's against spears. Nope, it's not. Okay. I have to cure Oswald. Back on my feet. Okay, got a little bit of heal. No. And now she's confused. He can. That thing casts confusion whenever it can, right? 
Pretty sure it does. Complete. So let's see if it has a weakness against one element. Fire. Okay. Okay. That's something. It's my turn now. That is something. Um, what else? Not spears. Let's try daggers. Nope. Ow. Here goes. Okay. Before Casty does something very stupid. I have to get that out of the way. There you go. Coming right up. Time to shine. So. Ooh. And ally skills to all for three turns. Mm. Damn it, uh, that is not helping. And Daughter's Charity, the reach of allies' items. I don't think that helps either in this moment. A touch of poison. So. So that's it. Ah! Okay, no. axes are a weakness. That is fantastic to know. Indulge me for a moment. That. Oh. I just oh, cleared it. Oh, that's annoying as heck, by the way. I'm investing in you. Thank you. I need a plan. Yeah, uh, you need to break this monster. Come on. Oh, on his last spell he uses fire. My dude. That was close. Okay. Now then. Let the calculations complete. Fire. So then let's burn that thing down. Nice. <laughs> Okay, and you are going to donate some more boosty points to Oswald. Sorry about that. Now then. Okay, and you are. Um, what are we doing? Items. I think a healing touch would be good. Four. Hmm. Yeah, for her. That helps. Here I go. And she, uh, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Dodge the next physical attack. Hmm. Honestly, I'm not sure what to do. Sorry, I'm just. Hmm. These hands. Let's try to do a lot of damage. So, yo, I thought that would happen. Okay, who of you is sleeping? Patricia is not sleeping. No, Oswald is also not sleeping. No, wait, nobody is sleeping. Ah, it woke me up. That's why. It woke us up. How nice of them. Okay, what do we do? Uh, I did not try yet if the bow works. Let's try. Nope, it doesn't. Hold it together. Okay. I have a talent for making do. So we will restore some HP for everybody, and we will at least cleanse one a pinch of, of the things. Thinking time. Uh, indulge me for a moment. Uh, okay, only two shields gone. That is not good. Yeah, I agree. That's bad. Uh, 
Hä? Oh, come on. I need a plan. Of course it can change it. Of course I am so lucky. <laughs> it's weak to sword, yeah. There is not a lot left. <laughs> and now it changed mutations. That is not helpful at all. Okay, let's try dagger. Nope. That. Hold it together. Whoa. <laughs> and only Oswald gets poisoned. <laughs> Poor guy. Uh, before he could not use fire, and now he, he cannot stop himself with using fire. Oh dear. So, and you are going to rest. Hey! No! She is... Okay, she's not confused anymore. So, heal yourself. Fantastic. So, okay, what do we do? We need ice. So let's break that thing finally. Uh, no, come the fuck on, oh, no. Here you go. Hey, a boss that really uses status effects is surprisingly annoying. And he's powering up. Hold it together. together. Okay. Uh. This will cool you down. Oh uh, no! It's it's. Is it doing next turn? Yeah, it is. Oh no! Uh. It has no more study is required. Okay. I guess that's cool though, like that. Okay, break. This will cool you down. Now. Okay. So that is and everybody's sleeping, of course. <laughs> Hold on a little bit more. Yeah. Well, the thing is he's basically taking away more or less everything. So Wait. Didn't I yet just wait one second? So first off we have a cleansing leaf, then we have a diffusing serum, then we have another cleansing leaf, another okay. And now hopefully they wake up. Okay, fantastic. Good. And now we are in a little bit better precision. God, that's an... Yeah, I don't like this enemy. I don't like him at all. Gotta admit. Uh, here, boost points, Oswald. Have fun. Okay, that's not so bad. And you can help her up. This will make it all right. You have my face, Misty. Moves the thing back on the next turn. Well, if it's red, I am betting that it I can take it down, but I'm just it is here, Oswald. I'm tr I'm trying just to take it down. That's my goal now. Right now. Do 
Mm. So now Oswald should have a realistic chance. Hopefully. Complete. It was for previous turn. Yeah, okay. Sorry. Come on. A week. Done. Mm. I've seen wow. Well, what an annoying enemy. <laughs> Just giving every negative effect. <gasps> oh dear god. Zetsby's finally gone. Yeah, and your people are alive? Question mark? I can't believe it. I really underestimated you. Yes, you did. Wait a second. I recognize those guys. Yeah, that's probably your guys. Hey, wake up. Oh, boss. I can't thank you enough, you saved my crew. Well then, give shiny. <laughs> We're out you our lives. Who knows what would have happened if you hadn't shown up? Well, that thing had like 20 moss. I have an idea what would have happened. Since you're all alive and well, I guess that means we can back to laying down tracks right away. My hat's off to you, traveler, truly. Okay. Resistant nut, money, and shiny. And feebling amulet. What is that? Extends the duration of inflicted enfeebling effects by one turn. Massively increases elemental defense. Okay. You know what? Oswald gets it. Just because. So is it safe now or will I get attacked again? That's now my question. Oh, I will get attacked, of course. <sighs> Here, Oswald, have fun. It would be one out of four feet. Um, what do you mean? No. Feel my wrath. Strike them down. You're finished. Time to shine. <laughs> Five people, that. twenty more. Oh god. <laughs> uh, yeah. Somewhat, something like that. Ah, uh, damn. Yeah, that was an annoying boss, honestly. Hey, guy. Hey there, Traveler. Everything's going off without a hitch, thanks to you. I know. So, what do you have? I can... Uh, muck him. Doesn't bring me anything. Okay. Uh... Do -do -do. The experiment I guess you now can catch that thing. Yeehaw! I guess so. But I don't... Do I want to? That's now the question. Rather. <laughs> Do I want to catch that thing even? I'm investing in you. That's a hope. Ow. <laughs> Double ow. <laughs> so, okay. Feel my wrath. Now have some fun with that lightning. Strike them down. You're finished. Oh, everybody's dead. Okay. Study harder. Yeah. Study harder. Stupid bird, stupid mole, study. How dare you attack me! So, how do I get... Ah! Oh, I see it, I see it, I see how I get there, I see it. First I have to take care of those birds, but then I can do that. The tide is turning. Three hours in. Oh, are we already? Nice. <laughs> Calculations complete. Oh, we're doing good, I guess. Strike them down. A week. So. Hmm. I've seen worse methods. So okay. Um, here I totally missed those. First of this one, Olive of Life. Okay, and then down here. Now we get the rest of the shiny. Hmm. 
strike them down. Bring it on. Dancer skills and have a better dance. Slip That's down. usually effective. <laughs> At least it works. So, and you'll get a sweeping cleaver. Oh. What? Your life? How dare you? Ow. Double out. What to do? What to do? Axe attack. So. Forgive me. Okay, well done. Well done. Okay. So, shiny. Natural magnetite. Natural magnetite so it, it, it's a quest item. Um give me a second. Uh side quests. All side quests. My dear Cass uh, Catherine, she's everything. Life is meaningless. Da 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 da. Ruined nation. It needs repairs. I could fix it, but need actual plans. Okay. A washed up letter, letter in Timbrain. Okay. I wish to procure dispatches from Beastingland and Curious Legend Great Wall. Falls from the far reaches of hell. Oh yeah, that was books. Okay. Someone has to stop my friend before he's gravely injured in the arena. I have no clue where he is. It's a clock tower. Okay. A present for his son. I have no clue what I have to give him. A troubled woman. Um, oh yeah, that was a sword. And she needs a miner's pickaxe. <laughs> he needs uh, to fight someone. He needs that this guy goes to sleep. Um, yeah, that's the temple where I cannot enter. Uh, then this apathetic girl. I have to find something for her. Uh, da -da -da. Then some thief. Da -da -da. Uh, procure must returns my wear. I shall lose everything. I have no clue where you are. Best friends have something. I have slapping her knee. Huh? I have something that was slapping her knee. A good joke. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Crop revival. Uh huh. No clue where that is. A good dish. Um, large soul stone. I could check on that and pilgrim stuff. Okay, I, that is to, belongs to some side quests that I have not even found. Okay, so far no problem. Out of my way! Here goes. <laughs> Slip, eh? No. Strike them down. A week. Time to shine. The winds of favor blow. I did it. I wasn't expecting that. So, okay. Um, let's con. Let's continue. Okay. So, is there something here? There should be. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yo. Let's have ourselves a show now. I'm just getting warmed up. That is nice. Um da -da -da. Slip, dang. It's my turn now. Uh, my axe is sharp. Yo, very good. No, sir. Now then, <laughs> the only one is left. It has to face Oswald of all people. I've seen worse methods. And suddenly the white bird had brown pants. So, okay, revitaliz revitalizing gem. So, one or two monster meetings and then we can leave. Hopefully. Thinking time. Strike them down. It's my turn now. So. Uh, my axe is sharp. Bonk. Fantastic. Yeehaw! And you are going to what does a lot of damage? He has nothing that does a lot of damage. Uh, 
take this. How's that? Well, now. Poison slash. I know no. Okay. So, and we have everybody at level 40, or very close in front of it. So. Mission accomplished. Very good. So. Um, hmm. Okay, the other people are all gone. Fantastic. So, and I did not find a pickaxe. Or can I talk to you now? Do you give me a pickaxe? Old class bronze shield. You can never do too many safety checks. After all, even the smallest oversight can cost someone their life. Yeah. Not so wrong, honestly. And whoop. Howdy there, friend. Oh dear. Hurts. Right. I I wonder actually. Is it me or are birds very often weak to wind? Doesn't that make like zero uh, sense? Or is that me? I, I mean, could be me. Maybe next time. So, I'm glad we can get back to work. Mm. Okay. So, I guess there is nobody with a pickaxe here anywhere. Hmm. Nope. Okay, but we found that. What is that? Unfinished tunnel. Okay. Good for us. Well done. So, what is next? What do we want to do next? Like, we have reached level 40. Uh, what I want to do is a new Delta. I want to go into this uh, cave over there. If you get good hit from wind, I don't think you'll just check it off, especially if you rely on it. <laughs> yeah, that is... that's probably a good point. Okay. So, but still... Townsperson, it was all for nothing. Mm -hmm. What? It's with him. Once a master leather worker whose pieces were sought after by famous people in the world over, however, lost all motivation after his, the passing of his beloved wife. And he closed his shop. He now spends his days keeping the memory of his wife alive. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, my guy. So, um, yeah. So that is the next thing that I wanted to do, and here I cannot do anything to get people out of the party. I cannot, re I really cannot uh, come alone to that place. So that is not just me. So. And now I would take now my guys, have a little rest. Oh, and I give them some nuts. So, let's see, where were they? Um, da -da 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 so, maximum HP goes to Temenos, because a heal bot needs that. Maximum SP goes to... Uh, I think Hikari, because he has way more abilities now that cost a lot. And elemental defense... Ooh, I give that to Throne. So, okay, Wriggling Root, da -da -da, Candy. Mm. So, and before we go further, we go here and rest a little bit. So every S the SP come back. Mm, point on them and press J. Mm. One second. Really? That works? <laughs> that actually works. Oh, here, I am I am me all alone. Okay, okay, thank you. 
How did you find that out? Don't tell me now it, it was in the in the wiki. That's not a good story. <laughs> okay, then yeah, I guess let's go alone. Only Oswald by himself. That will be interesting. So So, but I get the same amount of enemies. No. I am very hmm about that. Here, fire. have some fire. Burn. Try again. I need a plan. Fire. Burn. It written down there when you look at some stuff it shows interact button. Okay. Okay, they're hastened, and now attack first. Ow. Double ow. No. Indulge me for a So. Hmm. I've seen worse. <sighs> and also what gets even further ahead. <laughs> like when he comes back and he's basically a god of fighting. <laughs> I was like, Oswald, you are so selfish. No, I am not. <laughs> While he went to his own adventures as level 60 or something and has super mega artifacts of doom and destruction. That would be something. Let the experiment begin. Hmm. Indulge me, bro. Hmm. I had hoped that it does a little bit damage, Dibble, but, but no. So, ow. Now then. Fire. Burn. Okay, that's better. What? No, no, no. Oh, I don't like that, but luckily I don't need to boost. Oh, that makes it much Study easier. Harder. So, then let's continue onwards. Do, 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 do. Okay, now I'm curious to see what this will entail. Look at that! What a nice interaction! And immediately suspicious shiny in front oh, of me. Way. What are you? Ew. I need a player. Ew. Dire Skull Roller. That is concerning. It can... <laughs> it can cast dark magic on me. Okay. Yeah, it's level 40, but it's like for one character. It must be. So I should be fine. I've gained valuable insight. I should be fine, theoretically. I mean, I am 15 <laughs> levels ahead. The one thing that could happen and that would be a problem if... Uh, would be if I get stun-locked by an enemy. Like with sleeping or confusion or whatever. Thinking time. Don't mind if I do. Donk, ow. I need a play. So, and now we will finish Don't that with a stun, and then we will just rain damage on him. Feel my wrath. Indulge me, Okay, that enemy has like 5,000 hit points, I think. I've seen worse methods. Something like that. Interesting temple. Not very funny though. Did. Oh, a scorpion. Okay. Thinking time. Indulge me for a moment. Yeah. 
Not well. Use ice. Oh, come on. Uh, Oswald used everything but ice. Of course he did. No. Good. Finally ended. Uh, that's that's one thing that I really dislike when the game just you know when you're unlucky. <laughs> When you hit everything and he's just like you, you need fire and he uses ice and lightning lightning ice ice lightning i'm just like whoa oh look a big boy <laughs> thinking time a vagrant lizard Enjoy king that doesn't really look like a lizard king to me more like a mummy just no. not finished Indulge me for a moment. Hmm. Calculations complete. Indulge me for a moment. Okay, and we're done. Hmm. I've seen worse methods. Do -do -do. And there's a safe point ahead. Do I get a boss fight against this guy? Out of my way. I need a plan. Indulge me for a moment. Stuck. Ow. That was clear that this would happen. Indulge me for a moment. You're broken. You're finished. Good. I've gained valuable insight. Okay, then let's save for a moment. And check who that mysterious evil person is. Hello! Haha, <laughs> the longer I look, the prettier it gets. I, a sword this gorgeous belongs in the hand of a true warrior. Can you hear it? Listen closely. It says it wants to be wielded by me. And it hurts for blood. Ah, a battle of wits. A battle of wits? Uh, I don't think so. Thinking time. Well, okay. You have a lot. He's called Karma. Yeah, it's a lonely safe. Look, look, he's called Karma. And he has a lot of weaknesses. Unsheeting stance. Okay, what does that mean? Ow. Oh, look. Oh, how he's looking. No. He looks so edgy. Hey, you're trying way too hard, my guy. You're trying way too hard. Thinking time. Indulge me, bro. I need a plan. Feel my wrath! Indulge me for a moment. Okay, 7000 damage. That's nice. He stands ready. No. Karma is vulnerable to nature. <laughs> Indulge me for a moment. Well, I guess he has at least two elements, but I guess it's like that you can beat him for balancing or whatever. Now, that's not nice. I guess I have to actually heal. This one's for me. No. Indulge me for a moment. And broken again. So I want to actually Beautiful. test something on him. Calculations complete. So first, wisdom, what if I can really power up Oswald? I just want to see what happens then. Tiger and wolf. Ah, that's a new stance, I guess. Oh, look. Ah, oh, edgy. Hmm. Edge. I'm so proud of you that you are an edgelord, Indulge but that's, it's not very 
Oh, he has fire now? He has... Ch no, <laughs> he has changed his... Um, his stuff, his... Uh, his Indulge. resistances, and he has all of them. All of, of all of the weaknesses. We oh my goodness. Let me show you what I my So that's full power up. Let's see how much damage we do on him. Burst forth, mighty flames. Huh, not as much as I hoped. <laughs> stands ready, okay. Ah oh, now he has changed some flawless stands. Vulnerable? Time. What? That's probably a trap. Indulge me for a moment. I well, I have ah, oh, he has no vulnerabilities anymore. Is it that? I think it is. Indulge me for a moment. I need a play. Okay, okay. Calculations complete. Indulge me for a moment. Goes further. Okay, that starts to hurt. <coughs> is at its limit. I hope that's enough. Okay, let's heal myself. Jump. Yo, what the heck? Huh? Uh... What? Does this guy have a death counter or something like that? Like when he enters Thinking his down. ultimate stance, I have only that much time to kill him? Yeah. Like that was... that he used an... I have one button right now. That was no. clearly one. I need a plan. I don't get that. I don't get it. Indulge me for a moment. Hmm. I've seen worse methods. Sniper's bow. Okay. I will take that to the others. And there is some shiny. Let the experiment what begin. do I have to do? Like, he changes... No. Stance? What was that? Indulge me for a moment. Hmm. <laughs> Thinking time. Indulge me for a moment. Now then. Or do I have to flee them? I don't know. Indulge me for a moment. Maybe later. Now it's level 40. I've gained it is level 40. I should be able to deal with him. Hmm. So, 20,000. Okay, that's also good. Oh, looks! <laughs> More lizards! Okay, not electricity, not fire. <laughs> Now, thinking time. Indulge me for a moment. Your a weak. Hmm. I've seen worse methods. Hmm. Okay. Like I am sixteen levels above what I have to be. Okay. Is it maybe? <gasps> I have an idea. I have an idea. Hopefully it works. Even if if uh, if I fail. 
latent power plus. So, if I would die, that I rise again. Let's see if that works. Hmm. Okay, then let's test it out again. Let the experiment begin. And when I'm done with him. Indulge me for a moment. <coughs> I need a plan. Indulge me for a moment. Ow. Hmm. That hurts, my guy. Calculations complete. Indulge me for a moment. Or is it... Like, he's Study called harder. Karma. I think that has a reason. I hope it's not that I am supposed to not fight him. Because that would be a very stupid reason. So, yeah, let's go. Sword Hunter, da-da-da-da. You want to be fought. True warrior. Sword. It lost for blood. ba ba, -ba. My arts. Thinking time. So, and now I, I'm going to analyze him Let first. Look Let's you. see. He has 60,000. Okay. Okay. And his hostility no. grows. What does that mean? Is, is that... What is that? Is that some sort of death counter? Dude, could you please use something else than fire in this one time when fire is not the answer? Is at its limit. Thinking time. I guess I have to break him before that. It's like he has like a continuous death counter. And if I don't break him before that, he just, you know, kills me. Because he has then an I have one button active. Or something like that. Now then. Feel my wrath. Impart your wisdom, Alapax. <laughs> Thinking time. So, okay, and now we are taking yeah, some heal. This one's for me. <laughs> hmm. Okay. No. Less armor, that's fine, I guess. Indulge me for a wow, <laughs> okay. This one's for me. <clears throat> oh, come on. Indulge me for a moment. Oswald! Ah, he... Is... He has like... And... Where that. Did I go wrong? Ah, uh, okay. Chance. So now I cannot try again. With that. Indulge me for a moment. I, I swear, Oswald has now sort of <coughs> the tendency to just, you know, use the element that I don't need him to use. That I'm, I'm absolutely certain of that. And it's very annoying because this it has happened me. this stream way too often. For just to be like random. I need a plan. May your wounds be healed. Now then. Calculations complete. And I lost my buff as well. Indulge well done. Me. 
thinking time. Indulge him for a moment. Hmm. Calculations complete. Hmm. I need a play. So that was the second one. The question is now what comes when he has like his ultimate stance. As annoying as it is. Thinking time. Don't mind if I do. Yeah. In this mode, his hostility grows always. Okay, good to know that. Now then. Indulge me, brother. Thinking time. In pursuit of no- Feel my wrath! Oh, let's try. Okay, 10,000. That should be something. He stands ready. Okay. Flawless. And now we're here again. No. That's so stupid. That's bullshit. Let me look at you. 20. I cannot deal with almost 30,000 30, in this time. That's impossible. <laughs> The fuck? I need a plan. And I cannot flee. That there's nothing that I can do. I cannot deal uh, thirty thousand damage in this uh, time. And he is probably immune to everything that I could throw at him. He has highly powerful non-elemental damage to all foes, reduces their shield points regardless of their weakness. You know what? Let's try that. Take this. All according to plan. Okay, that worked for some reason. No. Calculations complete. So. So now what's coming? He stands ready and... Yes, uh, again, vulnerabilities. Okay, that's nice. And I don't have mana anymore. Well, that's something new as well. This one's for me. Ah, uh, fantastic. I am still healing against him. This one's for me. So I want to um, say, yeah, um, the other boss is not that annoying. I take it back. This boss is truly annoying. Okay, what is that? No. Hmm. And still, I cannot. I call upon the miracle of peace. So. Hmm. Let's. Ah. Uh, okay. Let's try. We have to. I think. Yep, he has no weaknesses against this kind of magic. Thinking time. Staff is also not working. Let's try holy light. I call down the light. Found a weakness. Ugh. Light, light, at least something. Yo, <laughs> calm down. 
I call upon the miracle of peace. And I have no mana anymore, and this happens, and play. that happens. Oh, come on! That is annoying as fuck, this enemy. I'm sorry that I'm salty, but this enemy makes you salty. That is shit. That's shit design. I cannot do anything. <sighs> Didn't I have anything for HP and SP? Here. This one's for me. <laughs> now then. So. Feel the power of the sacred flame. I call upon the miracle of peace. Uh, okay, uh, I thought like, hey, maybe I do something after this uh, quest, but holy shit, I am so tilted right now. Like, this guy is good at tilting. Don't mind if I do. Uh huh, oh, wonderful. Now then. This one's for me. This one's for me. Hmm. Also, I should say, um, just as a question, if any game developers ever see that, this is level 40, are you certain? Like, I have a level 56 character and I have problems. Serious problems, actually. <laughs> Thinking time. This one's for me. No. So and and honestly, like if this he's using any attack, I am basically just counter healing. That's like what I'm doing right now. Here. When he does a normal attack, I can do something. If he does not, I have to counter heal. I call down the light. Yeah, he's not changing stances. I think he's broken. Like, when he had like this super mega stance. Like here again, I'm so down that I just can this one's counter me. heal. When he does anything else than attacking normally, I have to counter heal. I need a plan. That is so fucking annoying. And again. Hmm. This one's for me. I hope this quest will be worth it, but I doubt it I, uh, already. Thinking time. So cleric. Feel my wrath. No, nothing of that helps. Grants a single ally the ability to act at the end of turn for three turns. Only one additional. Let's try this. Because I, I am at... Elfric, the flame bringer. I am at my wit's end. Honestly. Okay, that's nice of you. No. I call down the light. Thinking time. Call down the light. <coughs> ah, wonderful. Wonderful. This one's for me. Zack, let's heal up. Now then. So, and finally, he's broken. Fucking hell. 
What an annoying dipshit of a character. Unbreakable stance. Really? Vulnerable. But he's vulnerable to everything. And I'm out of... One second. Hopefully I can still do that. Give me mystical stuff. Yeah, he's vulnerable to everything, but he has like so many things. So many points, basically. Yeah, 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 your hostility grows. Fuck you. No, Oswald, not three. How about five? Ow. Yeah, wonder uh, wonderful, wonderful. Let... Oh. And I would have to heal up now. Is at its limit. Beautiful. So, I, I can... Oh. Yeah, okay, that was it. That was it. Fuck you, game. Fuck you so hard. I'm down. <coughs> I, I cannot do anything anymore. Don't mind if I do. It's too late, basically. This See? That's such bullshit. That boss is bullshit. Fuck you, game. Sorry, I'm out. That is... That is tilting. When you have this kind of a boss. What are you supposed to do against him? You know what? I, I'm, I'm checking him. Honestly, I'm checking this uh, on, the, on the wiki. I have not used the wiki yet. But, okay. I am... Um, I'm checking this. Like, what the... F what the hell? Here, and he uses... Yeah, it's it says from 50% uh, health point, he uses on onwards, he uses the flawless stance. And he has no weaknesses against uh, anything. Yeah, it is. This one is a bullshit character. And here, yeah, here it says you can only survive flawless stands if you are using an El Marti Soulstone, a Warrior's Vengeful Blade Counterattack, a Dancer's Ruinous Kick, or Temenos Latent Ability. That is, yeah. It's not for level 40. It is! That is a joke. That is the funny joke on it. It is meant for level 40. <laughs> so, yeah, that is... Like, wow, that's some bullshit. That enemy is some bullshit. And now I have also seen uh, what he gives me when I uh, win. What I get. And I think... What the heck is... So. 
Uh, and I'm pretty sure I'm not doing it. I'm just like, nope, you know what? Nope, fuck you. Fuck this game, fuck that, fuck this quest. Nope, not doing it. Can any anybody else can do it, not me. Like, wow, that is a shit design of for a boss. That is a beyond shitty design. If it's like, yeah, you have to use tactics, but no, you have to use a specific ability. There are only four ways to break him at this uh, certain point. When I do some events making in the game, I strapped some danger level to it isn't what I rather. My head. Yeah, no, like, honestly, Oswald is... Okay, it, it, just, okay, I'm salty, okay? I get it. It's not very fun to watch or to see, but honestly, now. Oswald is 16 levels ahead of what that place is for. 16! Okay? And he was struggling so fucking hard against an enemy that's level 40. I get it when it's like the sea monster that was here in the sea. If it's like an absolutely optional boss that has no quest dedicated to him, where is there is no quest of any kind. It's 100% optional. But then you put this kind of boss, I have to fight him alone. He has this death counter when he can insta-kill me when he decides to. And I have, it. and then I see also uh, what I get. Like I saw the, um, I checked on the wiki what I get for the quest as, you know, uh, for my troubles. And it's a joke. For that, I'm not going there again. Like that is bullshit. And if you have a character that is supposedly or should be that kind of overpowered and he's just like nope i'm i am surviving i'm hanging on that is uh not how that should work so and where is is here any shop that i could use because i guess i need more poem grenades now uh, because i in in this whole thing i wasted in this battle i wasted way more money than I would get for the quest. Way more. Already. So, yeah. So, no. As, so, I'm sorry This uh, that this stream is ending on this, this kind of negative note. But holy... Jesus is that a shit design and I am not going to stop repeating that You load it up now. Yeah, but still dude, it's ah Yeah uh, And anyway, I will get some food and Then I will next stream. I will explore a little bit more. I will train a little bit more if I feel especially masochistic, I will do the quest again, but uh, I will, I would not bet on it, okay? I just would not bet on it that, I, if I, that I'm that stupid, you know? Uh, in any case. Let's cruise that fuck ahead on, yeah. No, it's like, that is really bad design. I'm sorry, like, if any game developer ever sees that, do not design a boss like that. That is tilt material. That is material where your players just put the game away and say, fuck that game, and then they never pick it up ever again. And also not a potential Octopath Traveler 3, 4, or 25, or something like that. So, in any case, I'm off now, and yeah. In, I still hope you liked it and how I tilted. Um, yeah. Have a good one, uh, like and subscribe, etc. Pp. And yeah, bye bye.